I have a hat and church story. Oh, I don't go. think let's I've ever it. told you this. Yeah. It was a long time ago. It was yeah. Leesburg, Florida. And we were going to do this con- like a worship concert at church. And there's a row of deacons out front on the, the front porch of the, the church. Yeah, were they, they smoking? What are they and doing? And they were <laughs> smoking. Wait, wait, hold on. Really? <laughs> no, seriously. They were smoking. And I was walking in <laughs> to start the event. And yeah. I had the, a, a hat on. And he goes, hey. Take your hat off. This is a house of the Lord, for Christ's sake. (laughs) I got the number one pick. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, that positive. We back at it, baby. December the, what is that, 15th, 16th? December the 15th, coming in hot. Halfway through this month already, somehow. Alex Lagos in the studio, coming in hot. Andrew on the ones and twos. Ladies and gentlemen, live in the studio. Um, I was excited. Let's go, baby. One of my um, artists, artist, songwriter, singer, songwriter, Nashville native, one of my close friends, Steve Fee. Yes, and that's almost all right. I'm not a Nashville native, though. Now you live here. Is, but that's not oh, how that not? works. I don't think oh, that's yeah, how that works. Yeah. How long? Uh, five years. Uh, yeah. You're getting close to, I think, assuming that native okay. funk label. I think Dang. you're getting close. One time when I was that in- That feels good. Yeah. I was in like a journalism. I remember I get an F on a, on a uh, when I was in doing the news in college. And I said, Miami is battling, uh, is battling uh, South Florida down in the panhandle. And he goes, <laughs> dude. That, no. <laughs> I go. That's, I thought the panhandle. He goes, no, like a. Okay. Uh, I go. Like, oh, yeah. the panhandle's. Uh, oh, I don't. Th- I don't cook a lot. Oh, this size. <laughs> the value. Yeah, no, that makes, yeah, I'm gonna do, yeah. I'm making hot pockets. Yeah, dude. yeah, that makes sense. Uh, uh, let's see. Coming up, where we just got back from. Um, uh, we just got back from Here in Florida. Right? Florida, it's unbelievable. Yeah. We were in the panhandle, Miami and uh, West Palm Beach. Unbelievable. Uh, January tour dates in Huntsville, Alabama, February, Bowling Green, sold Again, out. that's not the Panhandle. Not the Panhandle. <laughs> let's, uh, uh, let's see. Cincinnati sold out. Still uh, added a second show. Saginaw, Michigan, Indianapolis sold out. Shipshawana sold out. Grand Rapids. And then March, Albuquerque, El Paso, Midland, Shreveport, uh, Fort Worth, Fayetteville. Uh, there's a lot more. Uh, anyway, we have about 40, 45 dates. Shows have been on fire, dude. Fee, what have you been up to, dog? Hey, no, so question. When you say sold out, yeah. like just first of all, does that make you feel good? Yeah, like, we're very got, good. Yeah, it's yeah. got to, it has to. Also, Dude, what's your message I, to I, those I know where cities? this, I know where this, no, I know where this no, no, is no, going. No, it's not, it's not, it's not. <laughs> what's your message to the cities where you're like, hey, wherever'sville, Indiana, yeah, sold out, sold out. So if you want to come, you can't. Uh, like, what, how's that feel to them? Let me think. I never thought about them. You know, I don't think I don't think I never about, they don't come them. to my shows. I don't think about them. <laughs> they don't exist. Well, I think I all right, here's why I think because we put all the tour the, those are all the cities. I get the counts every week. Alex does not. Mm-hmm. So I know what the status of those shows are. Mm-hmm. You we just have them all listed. Is this right. helping my case or no? <laughs> I don't yeah. I say keep going. Yeah, keep going. <laughs> like everyone sold out. Yeah. Uh no, well, there's some of them um, I don't know. That I I think I posted like I've seen that um they're, they're like Adele took out a bunch of billboards in LA to just say like Staples Center. Look up Adele, Adele sold out billboard. Uh, I bet there's, I bet that's up. See if there's images of it. I saw like a bunch of memes about is this it. recent. Yeah, there, it, oh, is. there it, is. it is. Yeah. And it was like, Adele is a baller for this. Like, th- look, look, those aren't digital, right? No, that's a, no, that's like, that's hard real. copy. All right, so she goes, <laughs> that's hard. It's, that, hard copy. it's, it's a Dell copy billboard. All right, right so here. this is, it's a Dell, the bit where if you're listening, a Dell sold out August 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, <laughs> Staples Center. That's pre printed. They didn't put sold out on there later. <laughs> yeah. How are you going to stamp on You're top getting of it. all those billboards. Does that make sense? Wait, so this is before they're sold out? They print no, the billboards? They, I think they sold them out, and they, that's just okay, a flex. Okay, so my thought is... That's a marketing flex, I yes, think, right? but it's it's an advertisement for no one. Yes, no, it yes, is. Yes. It's for the brand, yes, though. Exactly, but it's, it's like not... not it's we're not all helping. saying the same thing. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's not doing anything no, but it is. better for anyone else but like her. No one's going to come to, no more people are going to come to the Staples Center show. They shows. physically right. can't. They can't. But they're going to, but if, the, uh, also. It's it's basically, it says Adele Staples Center, you can't come. Adele got that billboard just to gloat. 
That's what the is this in L.A. though? Like, yeah, I mean, I'm yeah. even trying to make the argument for her. Like, if she put this in another city that they, isn't they, sold out yet, they may be that like, would oh, make she sold out sense. Disclaimer: uh, Just to be clear, I love it. Yeah, <laughs> I, I'm not saying I wouldn't do it. I'm just saying it's not for any people except. I, I, well, her. I do know that I put like if I, we have five shows sold out, that they they send me a graphic to put on my Instagram. It says sold out. Right. And whenever I'm around. Every who was I? Where was I? Once so, some somebody that you go, dude, it looks like you're killing it. I go, well, I'm doing great. I'm doing good, but but I have to say, right. I have to make sure people know I'm doing good. Is that <laughs> is that an insecurity? Uh, think, uh, it is partially marketing too, partially. That's like goes yeah. back to that thing where like, dude, how long just, is this podcast? Hey, <laughs> <laughs> okay, just say. Hey, <laughs> just say that you're insecure. Yeah. <laughs> And, and they're probably, and you can also uh, on every, obviously those Adele shows and by my shows, so you can get tickets on the secondary market, of course. I do wonder how early they planned this sold out billboard. That's though. what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Like how, cause you know, she's going to sell it out. Like it is Adele. But look, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, she couldn't sell out Staples, seven Staples Center now. For a week? She sold out Staples Center for a week. <laughs> wow. I mean, that's a, that's like Morgan Wallen numbers, yeah. dog. That's unbelievable. Wow. <laughs> because the joke's on Alabama. I've been singing this Morgan Wallen song for like a week straight. Do you guys like, do you guys do this when you, you like a song you like? Do you just put it on repeat? I absolutely you do. You do? Yeah, I do. Just over and over? I do yeah. for sure. I did on the way here. Yeah. What song? Uh, It's by 1975. Okay. You're one of those guys. Too. Uh, what? Don't they like a 1975 or like they're like, we're different? I, I don't know them. No, they're like, but if you like the 1975s, it's cool. That's I think, a cool yeah, I think thing it's kind of like. a, a hipster band to get on. Yeah. yeah. Uh, You're not like listening to the new Kenny Chesney. I actually saw like a tweet by Chris Martin from Coldplay, and he was like, these are like a couple of my new favorite songs. The 1975s. So is that, that Mike? Is, is that good enough, that Mike? Mm -hmm. is that his, uh, if you want to pull yeah. it down a little bit, that'd be cool. Yeah. All right. Is you're, that you're definitely close enough get to get in there. Oh, so on see. Alabama. Miami. Okay. Uh, we can well, sing it together. Hey, no, we have a, uh, should we, this is a teaser. Uh, people don't know about this, but me and uh, me and Steve wrote a song together. What? Yeah, it's unbelievable. It's coming. They out. don't even know about no, it. No, it's coming no. out in January. Uh, it, oh, it's coming out. It's coming out. It January. can't wait to come out. This song is called Every Christian Music Video. <laughs> no way. Because if if all right, if ever if you know anything, if you ever seen a Christian music video, oh, I have to cough. I don't know what to okay, do. Yeah, like, just do lean I, away. Just <laughs> like, yeah, you're okay, good. All right. Every Christian music video, it starts out. <laughs> With a husband and wife fighting. Of course. There's a fight. Yep. No one knows what the fight's about. Right. It's very vague. That lets you put your own troubles into the Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there, there's maybe there's a stack of bills. There's like a... Yeah, hard times. Hard it's times. It's just like, it's nominal, just benign, hard time. Hard time. The, guy, the guy gets in the truck, leaves. Mm. And the, the, the woman is at home, stranded, kids crying. Where's dad? Dad goes, has some kind of... Well, so so wait. Here's what we know so far. <laughs> let's let's yeah. size up Unpack where we're at this, in yeah. the plot. Yeah. So problems. Yeah. And it all looks like B-roll Hallmark yeah, channel very, footage. Yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah, it's yeah. like you know, so the bills and everything, yeah, and so yeah, yeah. and they're screaming. It's you know usually shot poorly or you know yeah, yeah, it, yeah. It's raining outside. It's raining outside. Classic. It's gloomy. Very. That's gloomy. in the song too. Yeah. It's in the song. Uh, yeah. And then obviously yeah <laughs> the dude i always say the dude's always the one that screwed up because sure, like, yeah, of course sure. yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. 100 yeah. again uh, 100%. who are we marketing christian music to? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> With, that soccer moms soccer yeah moms. the guy screwed up yeah yeah and then and then the actor is like a woman like but we can't have her being like too hot right because she can't be like sexy right obviously because we can't have guys like i want to watch that video right so <laughs> the jokes are like there's always a random. It's freaking hilarious. But the music video, it needs to has to have a music video. Yeah, that's why it can't. It can't be just audio. Right. So, but then he drives away. He has some kind of like, like uh, there's like a. I wrote one of the jokes like there's a pill bottle, on the like on the floor. But like, Christians can never have a beer. But they can have prescription, <laughs> which is way just, worse. It's just rolling around the floor. Way boards. worse. But that's like very. It's a little bit more like. What is it? But it's a it's, it's elite. It's it's elite. But Christians are like, uh, if you don't know like the ins and outs of Christianity, Christians are like kind of cool with that. With what? With like like painkillers, like because they like I kind of got it's them. It's a prescription. From, no one's writing ah, scripts for you. right. Yeah, 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 it was maybe at one point. It was yeah, at yeah, one yeah, point. Yeah, yeah. The Christians are kind of like okay with that. 
It's like, but you can't have a Christian music video where a guy's drinking a beer. It's not gonna. <laughs> That's a pretty broad statement. Christian's totally cool with no, it. No, yeah, yeah. I I, in, every one of I them. I speak in broad strokes. And then he has the guy always has like a come to Jesus moment. Yep. Out, he sees like a cross in up in the or a tree or something. <laughs> a cross in a tree. <laughs> or he sees like one of those tree crosses, man. He, drives, sees like, man. he drives past like a church and he goes in and there's like it's like the Home Alone scene where the guy comes like it's like you know your yeah. family's the most important and then he goes home <laughs> and then. Because it, it's a three and a half minute song. He goes home. Everybody hugs. We did yeah, it. You have to it. cover yeah, yeah. so much ground <laughs> so in three minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, like the plot is like, what totally happened? Totally obsolete. You don't know. Yeah. You don't know why they're upset. You don't know why yeah. he left. You have no <laughs> idea what happened in the church. Yeah. And the church is usually like, yeah, like it, it looks like it's in. God, this, like, I can't wait to in Montana somewhere. Yeah. yeah. And then he and then he's like drives past the liquor store. He's like he might turn in, but he's like nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he like comes home and then everybody's elated. And then at the end of the video is like, did they see a therapist? Heck no. Are they on the church front row? It's unbelievable, dude. It's unbelievable. I can't wait. You said January? Yeah, it's coming out in January. Nice, where, dude. Where just, where'd that, like the idea, where was the inception of that? I came I, 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 uh, in rehab. Okay. I, because uh, we went to a church in, vice, oh, I got to go back to rehab, dude. You've been sitting on this idea. No, the guy's got a, a lot of ideas. Yeah. No, Church or Wheat Shop came from there. Yeah. With me and my buddy. Um, I can't say his name, but uh, my buddy who, rest in peace, passed away from uh, cocaine oh, man. addiction. And we had that joke because we were driving around somewhere and I go, this sounds like a, that, it was like elevated. And I go, there's an elevation church. Right. And that's confusing. And I've been, that joke, there's like a bunch of them that came from there. I don't, I don't want to go back to rehab, but like that you have like, you're, you're very clear and you don't have a phone. Mm -hmm. Right. And you're just like, like I try to write, do you ever try to do this creatively? Try to write or Alex too. You sit down and then you're like, it's just like, like whenever there's any oh, kind yeah. of like uncomfortability, this, you just right. grab it and you just look at it mm -hmm. because it's like, you're sitting there trying to think of a punchline or, and you go, mm, and it's uncomfortable. That's one of the differences with songwriting when you're co-writing. Because it's oh, like yeah. not cool to be you can't just, really like, look on just it. like rolling through yeah. social media. Yeah, you can't be a you know, during Twitter. a, a yeah. co-write. And so it's like you kind of embrace that. Just that be in void there. Yeah. Together. Like we got to go. Yeah. Maybe I could. I mean. But you, I mean. I'm going to go without my phone. No, you're not. No, yeah. no, you're not. No, you're not. Do you co-write your jokes ever? Do you ever like collaborate? Uh, sometimes I, I every now and then, but it, it's like an ego thing where like if a guy's like this joke will kill for you and then it does kill and you're like, oh, I wish it. I want to write it. Has that made its way into comedy where, where like co-writing is more like music? A obviously, bit. people now know that people write yeah. songs for each other more often. But like, is that a comedy thing at all? Uh, like Kevin Hart. I remember seeing Kevin Hart at the Denver Improv and he had like four dudes on laptops in the back of the room. Are you serious? Yeah. Just like typing away. No, I think they were day trading. They might have been day trading. You know, they might have been day trading. Yeah. They might have been on crypto early. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> early. <laughs> Uh, they, I, I would say, hey, can you help? Like, I try to do this bit. I, I always try to do bits, and they always go horribly. With my buddy Brian, Brian Bates, I go, you know the um the swimmer that like changed his gender mm -hmm. to like become a he was like a oh, yeah, he was yeah, like yeah. a man that became a woman swimmer, and then he like won everything. Well, he didn't win. He got like tenth. I go, dude, you can't get tenth. If you switch, <laughs> if you switch, if you... <laughs> no, look it up. It's the uh no, we don't. Whatever the guy's name is, he's a transgender uh swimmer. Uh, Leah Thompson, Leah Thompson, or something like that. Yeah, look at uh, yeah, Leah Thomas. Yeah, and look up her NCAA. Yeah, NCAA uh, records, NCAA championships. Uh, what her what she uh, qualified at. Leah Thomas becomes first transgender woman to win, uh, but not in the NCAA's. Like she got to the to the finals. She won that one, and then she was like in the in the butterfly or like the freestyle or whatever. She got tenth. And I was like, dude, you can't switch genders and get 10. <laughs> like LeBron can go to the WNBA and be like, dude, he put up like 15 and you got to no, you got to put up 70, dude. See, I can't say yeah. that. You get the comedian pass. I can say that. Oh, you I don't get, have, oh, yeah, you got to sit that one out. I don't have like a hall pass. Yeah, you, you got to sit that one out. Card. I do. Well, yeah, well, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. I think I was in jail and they got out of jail. Now, yeah. She was like, she got like, who's your, who's. Who's your squad? So if you switch, you you abandon the boys, right? They're they're obviously not with you anymore. 
right? The dudes aren't with you. And then the girl, but you're, they're not with you. So now you're just like, you, and also you got to win by, you got to win by three pool lengths. <laughs> you got to dominate. Pool. You got to dominate. Dude. Yeah. 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 I'm trying to pull this up, but every yeah, news can't. every news place wants me to pay forty bucks a month to yeah, read it. Yeah, so put behind the paywall, dog. Do, right. Just pay. Have you not seen his sold out signs? You have hey, money. Come on, dog. Yeah, to we pay. got money, dude. <laughs> for the news, <laughs> we don't have money websites, for that. bro. Uh, nah, we don't have to look it up. But yeah, I look because I looked it up for the bit. Uh, anyway, the the bit was the joke that I didn't that didn't work. I go, well, there's a lot of bits that I feel like I tell. And they're not good. But so for this joke, I'm going to switch my gender to be a female. So I'm going to turn around and want to come again for this joke that I'm identifying as a female. And then I was like, ladies, like, <laughs> and then it was, immediately. no, I go, ladies, like, honestly, like we get paid 75 cents on the, on the dollar that men pay, but like, it's pretty worth it, yo, because I'd be lazy. Or so, and they were like, "No, dude!" Everybody in the crowd was like, "No, dude!" Everybody was like, "What city did you what? do this in?" Here. Yeah, oh. yeah. I did. That's a West if, Coast. That's a that West Coast joke. I don't know. No, but if that I, doesn't work here. Yeah, I don't know where it's gonna work. <laughs> well, it would, it would go. They were like, they just Brian Bates, who's my buddy, who was watching. That's back to the point. He's like, does, there, does anybody ever help you? He was watching. He's like. He's like, I see where you were going. Yeah, like I, I, but I didn't. That wasn't it. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's requiring a lot of the listener. He's like, like, start off by being like, by being like, we do like to get our nails painted or something easier. Yeah. And then just don't go. Just walk him up to it. He's like, what's the deal with like, uh, my boyfriend's always like going on a date at seven and he shows up at seven. Like I need time to like put it like, <laughs> like don't. Go all the way. And, right. But it was, it, it, then I go, every time a joke bombs, like, do you go, do you do it again or do you just get rid of it? And I haven't done that one. I haven't done that one. <laughs> <laughs> so there's, there's the answer. That one's I'm going to bring one. that one back. I'm going to, but, but you could identify as a different, because that kid. <clears throat> it seems like a long joke. It's not good. No, it's just, no, it's not. just like, it takes up a lot of time. Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I go, I'm going to identify, I do the swimmer, but I was like, well, that'd be nice for comedy. I could identify as a different race or gender and do a joke. And then obviously it didn't go well, Yeah, but <laughs> I'm going to rework it. I like that you tried it. Though. I'm going to rework right. it. And yeah, I love actually, that I'm weighing on your, on your jokes and I've, then you're like, I've never done that. No, nah, yeah, <laughs> I'm yeah. I'm like, but I'm going to tell John. Well, you could try it. <laughs> well, I was doing good. I had the crowd. The crowd was like with me. So you could kind of take them to a place that. You're not sure about. Right. Yeah. It's they just, seeing, it's just, you know, well, that, y'all going to come? Y'all going to not come? We went to LA and then Florida. Yeah. Two do weekends back to back. Just, just all different. The people all different. And you're like, this joke killed last week. No, this joke bombed last week. Now they're carrying you on the streets. <laughs> <laughs> are you, are you like factoring that in? Like, well, I mean, like, you don't know until you get out there, but you go, we'll see. Like we were in, we were in Miami and it was all Cuban, all Cuban people. And they were, they were fans of mine. Cause they were there, they bought tickets, but I was like, listen, I don't know what's going on here. I don't know what, like uh, we're, I'm shooting from the hip out here, but I just came in very like, Hey, I don't, this is, I'm on the way. It's, I'm on the, it's a way yeah. team for me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like I'm on the road. Like, I don't know if I do Zanies or Lexington, Kentucky, right. I got it. Home totally. Game. Say less. Yeah. Yeah. I go, dude, I go, Miami. <laughs> like all. Right. And I go, I don't even know. Is it Christians, non Christians, right. Republican, Democrat? I don't know what's going on because like Florida is very Augusta. like. Yeah. Hey, right. I don't think you can say that. But no, yeah. I mean, look. <laughs> <laughs> this week's episode, ladies and gentlemen, brought to you by Manscaped. Mm -hmm. They're back, dude. A loyal, a loyal sponsor. We love it. Of the pod. I do. Do you think, you know how, you know, women can, like, it, when you're, wife travels does she have a lot of stuff yeah like a lot a of decent amount of stuff i would say toiletries but they're not that like uh, i used to yeah. have, I, am i becoming that guy the toiletry guy yeah because now the manscaped package yeah is a lot it's robust but then once you get like you get a couple of the things and you like them 
then you're like, what do you tra- now I travel with? I'll them. be honest too. Like the the case that it comes with, I or love that I can just throw it in and take it robust. on the road because yeah. like I like to obviously if I can take yeah. care of it at home before I go, yeah. great. But usually I run out of time and I just got to throw stuff in a suitcase and so throw it all in. They the have bag like and the, go. yeah, they have like the the body. What is it like the body? Like this, it's not it's cologne, but it's like. The well, they have the crop reviver. Yeah, that one's. <laughs> I like that one. That dude. one's good. I'm, you know, have you ever been to like a like a uh, like a spa, and then they like they have all the stuff that you would normally do. I'm like, ah, oh, give me that. Yeah, give me that's what that, that's what the package is. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yes. I'm like, dude, give me that. I'm like, you're like, you don't you don't need that. I'm like, I do. I need it. Yeah, I didn't know that I needed it, but yeah, now that I know it exists, like it. I know I need it. For Manscaped.com, sure. ladies and gentlemen. Uh, net positive. Use the promo code net positive twenty percent off your entire order plus free shipping that's an unbelievable deal i would say when's this kind of come out uh the 13th 13th 15th of december yep you're gonna get this by christmas for sure yeah i think so yeah Hit for it. sure and a lot of uh the women that listen to this podcast we've said this before there's some things that you cannot get your uh, some things that your man's gonna be offended by that no, if they're you gonna get be him psyched. for Christmas. They're going to be so excited to get this. I They'll be you. stoked. But this is kind of like a, uh, uh, it's a kind of like a subtle. You need to do better in this area. But but also, a guy doesn't have like ego involved in this. No. Like if you go, hey, you, like somebody said, what were you we talking about? That was it. Who said that if you buy? Oh, it wasn't on this podcast. Lydia said, if you buy your husband, um, like. Um, hair restoration yeah that is that could be offensive that's tough yeah yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah that's that, uh huh. that's the that's the opposite of what we're saying here yes yeah the, if you buy like something that you want your husband to do better at mm-hmm. like i shouldn't speak on behalf of all men but i think uh i wouldn't feel any kind of oh you think i'm bad in this area no and, this. and all, i mean like flip it around if i was to buy my wife like a new curling iron yeah she wouldn't Great be point. like oh yeah. what i don't curl my hair well it's like no yeah, no, no, yeah. no i just know that was you that would your like wife's this. voice like, that was her yeah oh you don't think i curl my hair yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. alex exactly really you what only like me when i have my okay yeah <laughs> net yeah. positive uh is the promo code manscape.com 20 percent off uh your entire order with free shipping manscape.com and you could it's this is a um you can tell somebody it's a gift it's kind of from John Christ. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you know, and the, some people come up, if you if, well, presented by, <laughs> yeah, presented. By. I said, remember I said that if you come, if you wear a forgive your parents shirt, you come to the meet and greet that I'll pay for your, your, your drinks. Yeah. I've been, I've been eating those words. I've been doing that every weekend. <laughs> I've paid the hundreds of dollars and they go, everybody goes, See, I've did it this weekend. They Venmo me the receipt. And I go, I told, I said, I would, I said, <laughs> Tough, I would, dude. So if you come to the, if you, if I'm just going to say, if you come to the meet and greet, says my husband, is uh my husband has been properly manicured thanks to you yeah but i'm not uh, are you gonna fact check that i'll just dap him up <laughs> <laughs> i'll just dap him up and say hey you're welcome yeah. you're welcome for all this yeah. uh manscape.com a uh, net positive promo code put it in 20 percent off uh, your entire order free shipping we've been sitting dude i'll tell you about this we had <laughs> i don't a, think uh, i can say that no you can say that all right i went to a um i went to a uh, um a church well, two things. Let me tell you this. You know who Jesse Duplantis is? That's familiar. Yes. Jesse Duplantis uh, is like a um, is like a, a mega church pastor. He's like he has like private jets. This yeah. guy, what? you recognize that guy? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, Where's yeah, he yeah. at? Uh, heaven, did. <laughs> but I don't know. Heaven on earth. Louisiana is where he was based out of. Oh, he's in Louisiana. He's based out of. Yeah. He's. he's- he died? Uh, no, he's not there. Oh, no, that's what I thought yeah. you were saying. That's the okay. joke. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, there's Jesse. Yeah, so he has a bu- he has a bunch of uh he's very like uh it was send us money to our website, right? Like we're gonna you're gonna get rich. Not you're yeah. gonna get rich, God's gonna take you like huge ministry, He'll bless you. private jets, all this guy, yeah. right? So this is the type of thing that we usually like knock on. Or no, we do knock on. Not him specifically, but our but our I was in the green room of the show and our video guy was he had done some work for him this is a while he'd done some work he goes you know jesse duplantis it's like joel osteen like oh yeah 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 mm-hmm. and he goes i used to i used to either work for him or and he goes i uh i worked for him or did some video work for him and my wife my wife was in the hospital with some kind of disease or something and she didn't have health insurance and that guy paid for everything. Wow. 
and like out of his own pocket and like never said a word about it. Wow. And you just go, huh? Yeah. You know, have you ever like, you just go, uh, well, cause you want to like, yeah. like I trash on stuff like that. It's like, like a, it's like a cognitive dissonance thing where you're yeah. like, that's not what I thought it was. And he goes, I, do dude, he goes, I, uh, I would be dead without Jesse Duplantis. Right. Wow. And I was just like, wait, what? Like, so I should donate right here on the side as we Yeah, yeah, you it. Well, they get, you gotta, yeah, he's going to send you a private jet. Yeah. But he, but he, yeah. I would say, I would be honest with you, say, like, I've seen some stuff, some sermons of his that are like, I, I kind of out of pocket. But then you go, well, this guy uh, is in front of me saying right. that he saved my wife's life. Yeah. Because she didn't have health insurance and he covered the bill for like a year. That's crazy. And you go, like, like, um, we talked about that that uh, the drummer the drummer thing. Yeah, you know this with the uh, the drummer and the um, the mega church with, drummer with that, the flying. Yeah, that whole controversy. Yeah. Oh, there it is. So this Was is that an update. Yeah, this is uh, from the event last yeah. week, and this is they, so they, oh, they got for pyro. The drummer. <laughs> yeah, they got on, pyro. Dude. They got Santa coming in on the cable. Oh, this, this hey, is man, lit, dude. Look at him, man. <laughs> Yo, Santa. Where is that in the in the, hey, in yeah. the message Bible? <laughs> where does he go? There he goes. <laughs> Yeah, where does he go to the end? Because I don't think there's a drop off. This the is the yeah, and it then this is really the awkward just against yeah. the back wall. He's like, uh, he's sitting uh, back there, and everybody's like, is he still in there? Yeah, yeah. There's the drummers. There you go. They lit up like marshmallow. Okay, and I and and I said, I think I said this at the time, and Steve, I go like the 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 the, you know what like a like a hack joke is, like a like a joke. It's ha- it's like dude, it's like. Like God, ble- like a uh, bless your heart, meaning that's going to be something bad. Right. It's like a hack joke. Like okay. We, All it's right. like a hack. You know what? Like hack songwriting is like dirt roads and truck. You're like, dude, we already right. Like what's new? What's, sure, sure. Like, this yeah, yeah, is yeah. old. Like yeah. Oh, look at that. They, they have real camels. camels. In there? There's three real camels. That's gangster, dude. But like the I said, <laughs> those camels are like, what is happening? He's like, dude, I don't need to be in the Sahara. Dog. I mean, like. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I'm at First Baptist, dog. Oh, Jeez. <laughs> All the, but my premise was like, to say like, hey, you should be giving that money to the homeless. It's a hack bit at this point in Christianity. Like, because that's what everyone's critique is. Dude, right. this, and it's like, dude, you, like if this is a ticketed event, like all the money, like somebody, like you don't know if someone donated two million for it. Right. You don't know. Also that church, do, could donate millions of dollars to like you don't have no idea right it's the easiest it's like it's like saying that like so yeah it's like country female country artists writing a song about a guy was mean and dumped them <laughs> how well, many that's a times, great idea that's how like many times have i heard this like do, like and i there's a lot of country artists that are female that I think are unbelievable. <laughs> Let me just preface this. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I always have to, whenever I'm you going to so, say Taylor Swift, dude. You I like Taylor Swift. It. Yeah. I like Taylor Swift. But like, dude, and there's a, there's a lot of country artists that I think are unbelievable and young, up and coming female voices that obviously Carrie Underwood, uh, even Maren Morris, who we, that, that we disagree politically, but I like her music. Uh, Miranda Lambert. Um, there's a bunch of uh, younger country artists that are friends of mine that are great. But the, the, boyfriend dumped me yeah i don't need i'm better yeah it's we got it yeah we talked about last week we got it like churches oh look how big this like pastors yeah jet is he should be given that we got it yeah yeah no but i think i think that like a different angle of that and and even back to the duplantis thing is like it is it's such a knee-jerk Low hanging fruit That's argument a, yeah, yeah, yeah. to be like, You're saying it hey, they they should be giving money to to the, and I don't know this church. I don't either. I'll bet they are. I bet I bet they I'll are. I bet they're giving no. an 
extraordinary I amount of money they are. to people that need money. Yeah. And and cuz they cuz they they also are aware of this critique. Also, <laughs> they know. They, also, <laughs> super That's quick. stupid. Yeah. Also, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't You I get don't, it. You get don't it. Don't take my I'm not like endorsing and coming to their re- I'm just saying they probably do unbelievable mission work. Yep, probably also. They, and they're they're probably an asset to their community. And that's a lot. <laughs> That's unnecessary. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and the I, same thing yeah. with Jesse, like the Duplantis thing. It's Jesse, like, right? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. You go, it, the, it's like, it's like a, to be able to, I mean, but, but all four of us in this room to hold both of these things. Right. Like John, like people that are like, John Christ, like is everything. And like, he's a, like, not nah, really. I make up a lot of poor, or like John Christ is the antichrist. Like also not really. Like, right. To hold both of these things, just like, like, I'm sure they do unbelievable work at that church. Yeah, that seems like, like a little much. But like, I, like, <laughs> a, um, there's what's this guy's name? I t- I talked about this guy before on the podcast. I was gonna DM him, but I felt weird about it. Uh, this guy named Josh Benson. <laughs> I thought you were going to the that said Steph Curry right there. I was uh, like, yeah. I was gonna DM Steph we'll Curry. Get, we'll get to that. Uh, we talk about that on the podcast a bunch about how you you have to get up the courage to DM a celebrity. Oh, that's hilarious. Yeah, and you go, I, I don't think so. I don't think I'm going to do it. Uh, Who's Josh Benson? He's like a, a TikTok guy. Uh, oh, awesome. Uh, he might not, there he is, on the, all the way on the right. That guy all the way on the right. Uh, all the way. That's him? All the way on the right, right there. This guy. Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay, so he said, he, like, uh, you know um, Elevation? Mm-hmm. Elevation Worship, they're doing like Bridgestone. They're doing bridge to okay. elevation worship, like, and they're doing Bridgestone, and like the tickets are like a thousand dollars up front. Dude. Okay, okay. And then, and everybody's like, Christians need to be do-. like so hack. It's such a hack. And he goes, Hey, this is the secondary market. I don't know who you're getting mad at here, but these are people that want to see them that have drive, and also the band members and everybody that works there that gets paid pays taxes. Right. He was like. Like tax the church. He's like, a, 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 like it's a hack joke. Right. It's not even a joke. It's just a hack. I'm angry at Christianity. They should be giving more to homeless people. Right. And I've read look, this stat. Look up. Uh, can you look up this stat, yeah. Alex? Yeah, look up on. Christian philanthropy Barna. It should be a meme. I bet it's a meme. Uh, go to the go to images. I bet it's right here. Yeah, that first one in black. Read that. Or you read it, Steve. Christian philanthropy accounted for 70% of all American philanthropy in 2022 at 300 billion total. Keep going. Christians also outgave the US government in addressing global poverty. Like, that's hey, a, that's a fact. That's a fact. Whoa. Everybody and I, and I and I come I've I've come cr- critical of Christianity some a lot of times in my, but like right. dude I also come critical of internet memes how do we know that's, that's like super yeah, that's true. Bar, bar, yeah 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 no, I'm I trying trust, to check it I right trust now. all memes <laughs> also it's got to be true if it's a meme I saw that uh, uh, all memes matter yeah uh, who I also according to the memes uh, Pete Davidson has a new girlfriend so listen yeah I just <laughs> yeah they put it in context but that I saw I saw that. Somewhere else, and then I looked it up, and I found that meme. That is crazy. Barna is like a real Christian. Is that Gabe group. Lyons? Is, is do you know him? Yeah, I don't know. Him. That's him. Oh, that's him. There you go. Yeah. Um. But that you're like, but like, yeah, it, it is like in like comedian terminology, I guess is like as it, that's a hack thing. Like to it's say, just it's just the like think more before to you think more. Just just ponder. Just, hey. Give it 10 more minutes. Like, <laughs> <laughs> that's great. Dude. Just that's give great. it 10 more Just, minutes. Hey, hey, I, I know you like, you see the drummer and you go, that's excessive. And you want to get a, Arr. Just right. think for a second. Just a second. Just, just use your brain. Just for yeah. a second. Right. And have like a better angle. It's like being mad at the sun because it burns people. Yeah, have a, no, like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just have another, just another side. And listen, we, and we are critical of things in Christianity a mm-hmm. lot, mm-hmm. but the, <laughs> most of the most time, of the time. <laughs> yeah. they should be like Christian. They like, 
like and a, a lot of things that that is out of pocket like jesse duplan is having a private jet yeah or that drummer's hanging from the ceiling that, that might be optics wise doesn't look great but that this is great the, right. this is the net positive though that, yeah, that's no, it the net net t- t- net positive times a thousand yeah <laughs> like who's helping who's like outgave the u.s government in I, addressing global poverty Unbelievable. I was, I was in I was in a Presbyterian church on this. I was at a Presbyterian church that my buddy from my fraternity pastors now. And he goes, think about the Titanic. The Titanic, um, when it's the Titanic was Titanic was going down, they said women and children first. And he goes, That that is a that is a Judeo Christian idea. That's a Christian I that idea of putting others that are less fortunate that need perhaps need it more than you mm-hmm. putting them in front of you that comes from Christ. And, and like, he goes, oh, I'm not explaining as well. See, but like other cultures, Roman and historical, like they don't, they don't agree to that. Women are less than children are less than like right, men are right. like the ones in charge. He's like, that is like, you just think about that as like, that's just what we do in this country. Mm-hmm. It's that's from Christ. Mm-hmm. Is they go oh, put others in front of yourself like that's right. very, like that Christians aren't doing that like yeah they're doing like the most yeah they're doing Literally the most the most the Christians are doing the most but anyway he said that he's Josh said that on his TikTok somewhere and I was like that's a good point yeah and and that I've never seen that meme before yeah that's that's not making making the rounds that one's not making the rounds but you know what's making the rounds. Christians, <laughs> like, yeah. let's yeah. save it, dude. It's like we talked about this before. It's like a comic, comic going like, "What's up with black people liking chicken and watermelon?" Or like, "Oh, we're still doing that." Oh my gosh, like that's a that was like from the nineties. Yeah, can we, we like, edit this part out? Nah, that, uh, you can't be involved in that. But I can say that. I, yeah, they're like, if if a comic said that, I'd be like, "What? Wait, what?" Oh, yeah. it, like even a, if a black comic said it, yeah. Well, a, gl- a black comic wouldn't say that, but it's like that's what you think. That's like a like it's when a hack, I f- it's a hack bit. It's a hack bit. Yeah, like when yeah, I first yeah, started yeah. doing comedy and wrong, <laughs> and also wrong. Yeah, but also everybody likes watermelon chicken. Yeah, like, who like, make, <laughs> seriously, no friend of mine doesn't. Yeah. Who, oh yeah, or like or like a, I, when I first started comedy, I was like. I'm homeschooled. I don't make fun of homeschooled. To me, it was the goodest thing that ever happened to me. <laughs> right. Like when you start, that's a joke to start. When you start making jokes, that's one. Right. Like, <laughs> yeah, put it on the board. We got yeah, one. Yeah, <laughs> we got one. Hey, guys, we scored a yeah, joke. Yeah, yeah. We got one. Yeah. That's the, one of the first ones. And everybody goes, yeah. ah, we're like, one for 100, but we got one. I'm like, dude, you've been doing comedy for 12 years and you're doing homeschool is the goodest. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> the goodest. Like, well, but it's funny. Like, it's funny to start. Yeah. Yeah. And then you go, oh, like misdirection. It's That's a what gateway that joke. Like, yeah, it's a gateway. Yeah, yeah. But if you go, are right, all these years since like the mega church and the pastors of private jets and you're still like, how many compassion children could that have sponsored? Right. Like, did compassion right. yeah. is, and I'm critical of them too. <laughs> I've been critical of them too. The biggest nonprofit in the world. Compassion is one of the top five. Wow. One of the top five. Google the, it. <laughs> Google it up. I might be if I'm gonna be wrong on this, the fact checker. Largest the non pro. This is as of September 2022. Uh-oh. Okay. What's first? Fidelity investments. All right, that's not that's not, <laughs> not a good that's list. not the, yeah. the right <laughs> list. Apparently they have a charitable gift. No, fund. philanthropy. Oh yeah, that, no, that's not the right like, yeah. biggest nonprofits in Partners the world. Partners pool. Look at biggest nonprofits in the world. That's what this is. Oh. 100 largest nonprofits by revenue. Bill and Melinda Gates. Uh, okay, well. He, Global Fund, well, he's, Schwab. He's, and he's, the he's, elevation. He, <laughs> said, <laughs> he saved for us from COVID. Yeah. Oh, man. Uh, well, you can look it up. I, I want to tell you another thing about this. Uh, do you go to church, Steve, or no? Yes, I've been known to. Uh, we do. Yeah. We go <laughs> to you on the spot. <laughs> yeah. Wow. wow. Okay. You're like, wow, here we are. This is accountability yeah. time. Yeah. Uh, yes, we, we do... Uh, on occasion all right well i for a while i didn't right and my therapist was ch- trying to tell me he goes if you don't go just say you don't go because i was being like this like why do you say you go if you don't go and i was like well i, don't, I feel like people would judge me if i don't that was go. exactly my like right then that yeah. was my like well you should you say 
You do kind of go, but you don't go. Yeah, not not terribly often. Well, we I'm on the road. Go. I'm on the road mostly. Right, and well, yeah, and I'm not. But um, yeah, we do. Don't do go. <laughs> uh, we, yeah, we were just like we were in a spot of like, do what are we doing? What are we doing? Yeah, and then yeah. it's like COVID was like, you're not going to church. Yeah, I'm like, church. there's my reason. And then you don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now it's like, well, do you, uh, did you go back? And we're like, yeah. Like, mm. I got, I got, yeah. I just Where? started for like a, um, um, like two months ago. I started going. Well, I mean, I'm, I, I can't go because I'm on the road, mm -hmm. right? But this church called Ethos in town. But I was gonna say that because I went to my buddy's. Uh, Rob Pacienza was the president of my fraternity, and I was down at West Palm Beach, and one of the my brothers from my fraternity. I call them brothers. Yeah. But it's a stupid. Yeah, yeah no. He goes, that's, <laughs> it's, it's, that's really cool. He goes, Pacienza. <laughs> is a pastor here at a big, uh, I think Presbyterian church. And he goes, I got, I'll come, I'll be in there. And I went in there and I was wearing a hat and the security guard goes, Hey, you can't wear a hat in here. Whoa. Yeah. And I was like, I'm so sorry. I like, I didn't know the rules. And I was like, it's, it's just coming off the, uh, the thing with, at the world cup with that guy, uh, that was wearing like the, the rainbow, like the armband yeah the right and he got like detained right. we're like that's against the law there like being homosexual is against the law there mm -hmm. inside like, the church it's just that's that's well he said i go i was like oh these are the rules of this place mm -hmm. and i wanted to be respectful of the rules of the place sure i go my bad like mm -hmm. i voluntarily went in there it's not like they made me come there he was like hey do you and i go all right and i wore a hat and the guy goes hey here we don't do that and I was like taken aback a little bit by it, but I go, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And that's why every there's a new church on every block because they go, you we hate you if you wear a hat. Because mm. every church is different in their yeah. tradition of practice, right? Yeah, I mean that's a jump though. I don't know. If Not hate, hate you, but no, but like why is there a church on every block? Because this guy goes, we're, we right. we believe Jonah and the whale was. An allegory. It's, it's not what we were a talking about last week. Right, hey, right, right, right. When Nathan was like talking about how we just will basically write each other off for the littlest tiny things when he was talking about baptism. Yeah. He used the example of like, well, when do Good you one. dunk them? Yeah. So you agree we should dunk them, but when do you dunk them? How far? Them? Right. Yeah. And that's what we went back to with that with that church on that uh that church with the uh, all right. So But people love to feel like they're right about that love stuff. It. And love it. No, no one no one's right knows that they are. No one knows. They don't know that they are. And it's like what does that actually okay? So if, if this is the conversation we're having, what does that actually have to do with the way that you love God and the way that you love people? Zero today. Mm -hmm. Zero. Zero. I realize I don't know nothing. I have a hat and church story. Oh, I don't go. think Let's I've ever it. told you this. Yeah. It was a long time ago. It was yeah. Leesburg, Florida. That, oh. That's it's like I already am. I'm already on, on board. Nowheresville, Florida. But yeah. I, I remember it because of this. Um, back. I, it was in my mid twenties, and we were going to do this con like a worship concert at church. Yeah, and it's like for a bunch of high school students, and there's a row of deacons out front on on the like the front like porch of the the church. Yeah, like yeah, the, yeah. You know, the, the were they entryway. smoking? What are they? And they were smoking. Wait, hold on, really? <laughs> no, seriously, they were smoking. And I was walking in <laughs> to start the event, and yeah. I had the, a, a hat on and. This is what the guy says. That's I don't need this. Is the, the deacon said this? Yeah. This isn't me saying it. He goes, "Hey, take your hat off. This is a house of the Lord for Christ's sake." <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're you're hey in the priority list of like you, you got them all. You got well, like smoking. Too. Yeah. <laughs> you got yeah, four of yeah, them mixed yeah, up. Yeah, like yeah. just yeah. just waving an unfilter, yeah. just going like, "Hey, take your hat off. This yeah. is a house of the Lord for Christ's yeah, sake." Yeah. <laughs> Like you get like, but and that's what the, everybody's like, t like priorities or like, uh, like he had he had put the Lord's name in vain way down here. Yes, yes, it, yes. It's I think it's more up here than hat. And 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 oh, totally. And yeah, the, Christ's name in vain is uh, up here, and also treat your body as a temple. We know what a cigarette studio. <laughs> that's up here. But he had he was doing both of those, yeah. and he had hats. And up yeah, here. hat was like yeah, no yeah, yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> thou shalt not one. pass. And you go, like, what? How, how is hats number one? <laughs> I'm like, well, if it's for Christ's sake, then yeah, I'll take it off. For Christ's sake, put take your hat. He meant off. literally yeah. for Christ's yeah. sake. For the, yeah. for oh, the sake of Christ. Yeah, for the sake of the glory of Christ. Maybe it wasn't in vain then. Yeah. 
for Christ. Yeah, I, I think I don't know. There's a lot of nuance yeah. there. I don't yeah. know. Again, That's we don't hilarious. know. We can't judge. Yeah, we don't know. <laughs> but it's a really good story. That's an unbelievable. Yeah, that that, and that's why there's a a church on every block, right? Because he goes, "Hey, we we're we're doing hats at our church. Hey, come to our church, hats." But then, <laughs> you, you, like, we don't we do, no, you we don't know. You're gonna get up there right. and you're gonna be like, "Oh, I was wrong about that one." I think. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> it just doesn't like it. I think I don't come it with just any, doesn't. There's so many things that don't matter. I don't come with I don't come to much with confidence these days. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like I think in just the spiritual realm or just kind of everything. Like, like all encompassing life. <laughs> like, statement. To, like to be to be like we talk a lot on this podcast about everybody's protesting this and that just such hard stances on yeah. Twitter. Just yeah. like definitive like this is the and i go i got like thoughts about stuff but i'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm not you it's a, for me to to go down to cvs and get a sharpie and make a a sign like i don't right. know if i'm right right i i'm or like glue yourself to something i'd like. be like maybe i, I yeah yeah the lot you go i don't i mean just the confidence that people have to go i would net or like i go i I, I thought know. a lot about that. Like, what else is happening in their life? Lots. That was that. Well, or nothing. Or nothing. Or yeah. Or, yeah, it's like, or nothing. It's like nothing. I yeah, don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like me and my six cats. But I'm gonna pick at the pizza joint because they don't have. Like I just don't. Uh, I, I, I'm gonna free look options. At, yeah, yeah. They, the, oh, they, we've <laughs> we've gotten into that a bunch. On like people picketed Starbucks. Because they uh they didn't they they glued they cemented themselves into like little stands. What? They cemented them. We don't have to show that video. Yeah. They cemented themselves. What were they protesting? Uh the vegan upcharge in milk. Vegan milk. <laughs> <laughs> but I think they're I think they're joking. I think they're joking. I don't know what they are. Yeah. Uh, uh, it was a, it they're was, not joking. It was a setup or no? Uh, no, it's real. No, it's definitely real. It's definitely yeah. real. And then they had they they had these their these foundations that they cemented. They put they'd lift the cement up onto the stretcher. <laughs> Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. That's unbelievable. Well, I'll show it to you after that. I'll show you. It's wild. That you go, oh man, dude, people are people are having a tough time. Should we hit the protester of the week this week? Yeah, you oh, let's watch this. Oh, one. come yeah. on. Here we go. We're going protester to of the week. All right. So oh, are, I got is this a church. I got something. This is the same church. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the drummers yeah. come in in a sec. Yeah. Hold on, you see. <laughs> okay. Climate activists interrupt orchestra so there's an orchestra this is not in america uh they glued themselves hold on pause it really quick mm -hmm. they glued themselves to this uh, conductor stand it looks like is it uh yeah some sort of railing they yeah. glued themselves to the railing it's, it's very popular uh steve glue is people are gluing themselves to things it's the tool of choice Glu that's the new that's the new yeah, thing they glue themselves to the counter at starbucks protesting the milk We've glued people have glued what? themselves to uh basketball court. Basketball courts to protest, whatever, gluing themselves. Pieces of art. Yeah. Anyway, so watch this. This one's unbelievable. This is blowing my mind protest already. for the week. This security guard goes, hey, no. <laughs> picks up, he picks up the stand. Oh my <laughs> <laughs> picks up the stand. And escorts them out holding like the piece That's, of pizza. And they like, I don't even have to touch them. Yeah, they I can't not come perfect. with them too because they they're to glued to it. <laughs> <laughs> so they're just being led like cattle. That's unbelievable. The... Did you know, you know, uh, Daniel Tosh? He yeah. did like uh, uh, the Web Redemptions. You remember those? Yes. Yeah. Those are great. Those are great. Remember those? Yeah. Oh, gosh, yeah. Yeah, we're all at the age that we knew the, the Daniel Tosh web. So yeah. somebody would uh, hit themselves <laughs> in the nuts or something like that or... or uh surfing and nail the dock the beauty and pageant girl was a, a million brilliant uh web redemption and then the web redemption is he goes and meets them yeah and he goes talk us through what happened and then let's let's fix this it. yeah let's try it again yeah that one is just like <laughs> guys what happened <laughs> yeah, you're like dude. did you not did you not think that one through the thought yeah, the I, thoughts on the guy the guy who takes the thing out it looks yeah. like he's the only one who knows that the railing is detachable yeah everybody goes oh no yeah he's and like, he was he's like, like oh, fellas watch. leave this to me <laughs> hold my beer <laughs> yeah hold my beer he's like <laughs> watch this do you do we have to grab both of them he's like no he just grabs no, the thing and they got, it's, <laughs> it's one piece and just lead them out 
That's unbelievable. Because he wastes no time. He just walks right up and There's takes a, it yeah, photo. Forget, forget DM and celebrities. DM them. that guy. You'll be like, hey, what's going on? Yeah. That's a great. Hey, Get see if you can show. find the photo of them in the hallway because okay. there is a photo. How about and the it, thoughts of the people watching him pull the thing out of the ground in front of them as they're attached to it? Like, oh, our whole mission is falling <laughs> apart right now. Oh, no. And then where's he taking us? Oh, yeah. oh, he where, could literally where, also, just walk him in a stairwell and be like, take okay. him to the dumpster. <laughs> yeah, where's he go? Where are we going? Yeah, they're never, you can't DM him. They're no, I get it. Well, we always talk about how this is like protesting is like you, you don't see there doesn't seem like there's much much rehearsal. Right. Because there we, we watch one. I bet there's in the images right there. Uh, yeah, see, there it is. Uh, all the way to the bottom right there in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> So oh, you just put them down God. in the hallway, they're in the hallway, <laughs> holding on. To- <laughs> but we're still, we're still in protest. Oh, we're still in protest. They just look like they sell railings. <laughs> yeah, <now>. yeah. <laughs> and he has a bowl cut. That's it. This comes in. Uh, yeah, that's chrome. the photo. There's this a photo. This comes in brush. Yeah. People. <laughs> <laughs> they're holding on to it dude. <laughs> dude, yeah there's not a lot of pra- there's there's no rehearsal there's well, no practice there's just a lot of hype and this is going to be awesome. like this is gonna and then we're gonna like everybody's gonna be like because a lot of the times they have like a speech that they like i mean i've been doing stand-up for a long time you practice in front of the mirror it's all well and good you go out there it's a different game it's a different baby. game maybe <laughs> it's a different and then there's we've seen ones where like um they went into the they went. That's so unbelievable. She just looks like she's singing there, and the- <laughs> she looks like she's like you know, and to the republic for which it stands. Yeah, one, <laughs> Look at the also, conductor on the right. Just, is he smirking? Oh, he knows the railing comes out. That's oh, what he's, he's just waiting yeah. for. <laughs> he's All like, right, this is going to be great. And yeah. I said this, dude. I said this every time, and this is true again. Steve, it, uh, Steve, you can choose to not participate in this part. It's a, it's a, it's a <laughs> alpha. It's an alpha woman with a beta guy. Every time the girl goes, this is what we're doing. And then there's a beta man involved in the accomplice. Yeah, I'm going to stay off yeah, that you stay one. Out of that. You can stay out of that. Yeah, you can like, stay out of that. It's Opting like, out. Yeah, there's like, ta- yeah. I thought 50 things and vetoed all of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> fair, fair, fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, the, the, it's always like that. It's always like, and then there, we like, we watch one Steve where there's like, a, well, that um, picture especially. I mean, he's like, he's, he's literally thinking, is my hand really going to not come off this? Yeah. That's and what he's she's, thinking. She's she's ready. Yeah, she's committed. She, I mean, also, what are the odds that that thing comes out of there? It looks like it's, doesn't it? It looks like it doesn't come. It out It looks of like there. it's like like <laughs> seriously bolted in with four screws on each uh, base. Yeah. All right. If you if you listen to the podcast, you got to switch over to YouTube just yeah. to watch this part because yeah. it's a wild. Dude. Yeah. <laughs> they take her out. They take them out. And they go, hey. It's gone. You're you're done. Every yeah. all the orchestra members are just like laughing. At Do we them. know what this was in protest of? Climate matter. change. Yeah, climate change. And also, also, it also matter. All right, wait, John, are you saying climate change doesn't matter? No, <laughs> uh, no I'm not saying that. Okay. But also, climate change protest also hack. We said that. Like, <laughs> dude, we they've everybody's climate change is like the very easy one. Right. It's like it doesn't really. Or vegan, the vegans popular too. It's like a, it's like a, a bit that's been covered. It's like, right. yeah, we got it. Like, uh, um, this is in Germany, by the way. Yeah, in Germany. Yeah, you know, you know what? Yeah, a bit, I feel it. You know what? Bit German has been covered, by the way. Uh, soccer is boring. Mm-hmm. Like, who's still on that? Yeah, who's still on? The, like, the, it's uh, what? It's a non-starter. It's an idea. Look it's at a, it. I mean. It, it like like soccer is boring because they don't score is is so uh, like when soccer was first introduced to like America or like right no who's still making that joke yeah no or like the the like uh people from like people from like Alabama like <coughs> sleep with their sisters. You're like, real still? Right. Yeah, no, it's just like the low-hanging fruit, dude. What do you it's- think is one of the longest, like, it still hits jokes, though? Oh. How is it still hitting? Like, what ones do still hit that it's like, that one might never be hack? I mean... Like, there- what will always be funny? That's well, a good question for the comedian. I mean, uh, yeah. there's, there's some that I that I can't really touch. But there, I mean, oh, I, I got a good one. There's like, a, um, this joke, I've, I've heard it in a thousand different ways, where like... uh. You're on the golf course. You and your buddy are on the golf course, and uh, this is a, this is a street joke, by the way. A definition of a street joke is like it's not anyone's. It's mm-hmm. like 
used so commonly it's like a street joke okay like it's not it's just part of the culture yeah yep. like a yeah uh, me and my buddy were playing golf public domain yeah but nice. that's a better nice way to put it. Go, like, yeah. yeah me and my buddy were playing golf and uh I was we were, we had bet a lot of money and I was on the 18th green and I had a four foot putt for you know all it was a very significant moment and there was a funeral procession going by and the guy that was about to putt took his hat off had a moment of silence and shed a tear and he goes dude that is so that's awesome man I can't believe you would be so emotional about something like that and he goes. Well, I was married to her for 40 years. Like that, <laughs> that, like that never, it's like never gets old. It's yeah. like, a, it's like a street joke. Right. You go, uh, like, yeah. you kind of know where that's going. Yeah. It's, it's, it's supposed to, but it's like, or like a guy that like, uh, like the, those kind of jokes are like Just around. the classics. Yeah. Or like a guy. It, uh, yeah. I mean, a lot of them I can't say. That's but hard. The, the, yeah. Right. <laughs> that, but that kind of joke is like been around yeah. for years. And it's just like out there or like three guys walk into a bar, this guy, this guy, this guy, the first guy says this, the second yeah. guy says this, the third guy says like, right. That's like, it's just a joke, like a, like a skeleton. It's, yeah. yeah it's you a, can put whatever you want in right. it. Right. It's a, it's a, it's a fill it out yourself form. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Do, uh, there it is your own adventure. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah but in these boxes. The, the joke never gets I mean, like, Hey, we're like, but I guess the people like, so you see some of the like this the the Instagram moves so fast and like some of these like jokes that are like they go gosh dude I don't know if like we saw, we've talked about this before they were like that's too far ahead mm -hmm. like it wasn't people weren't ready to go there yet too soon too soon just yeah, like your transgender joke. yeah I bet it'll so get you're there. ahead of your I come, that's curve, it, dog <laughs> I'm ahead of yeah. It. Dang. I'm gonna switch genders for bro. a joke. They go, they go. In essence, we're not ready to go with you. Yet. Yeah, we're not. Yeah. We're yeah. not there yet. Yeah, we get, we get it. Yeah, it's not that we don't get it. Yeah, but sometimes you go to. <laughs> we just don't want it. We get it. We just don't want it. Yeah, we're not ready to buy it. Yeah, like my, who is that? My buddy had a joke. They're like, Alabama was the forty. Like I'm from Alabama, and people said Alabama was the 49th in education, and I was like, that's crazy. Who's 40 tenth? <laughs> like, uh, like right. Alabama. That's that's great. Look at him. Alex is dying. See, that's great. That's I love great. dumb stuff. Who's, 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 whose joke was that? Ah, I can't remember whose joke was that. He's a uh, comic. I've done. Ah, I forgot his name. Who's forty ten? Yeah. Uh, who's 10 forty ten? Good. But you're like. But that's in the in the that's, category of goodest. Yeah, that's it. No, one hundred percent. Yeah, that's. But you're like, it's a simple. Yeah, it's like an easy way to start. I cracked up at goodest too. Yeah. So that's just my yeah. brand, I guess. But like, that's some, where like, you're at. That's, that's just me. where you're yeah. at today. You but found like, me. <laughs> the the um the Dave Chappelle Saturday Night Live monologue where he was talking about Kanye. Yeah, is like. That is why that guy's like for that guy's the leader. Yeah, yeah. because he said things that you're like. I'll go with you. Mm -hmm. I'll go with you there. But it was almost, that was as far as I could go. Mm -hmm. And I'm right. a comic. Right. So you go, the low hanging fruit, we already did this. That's already been covered. And then I guess your your whole show is a combination of, of all of those things, really. Mm -hmm. Right. Dave Chappelle is known for some very silly jokes. Yeah. Like very, very silly. I'd have a joke about, yeah. Yeah. I mean, like, but well, like back on the Chappelle show, some yeah. of it was like slapstickish. Very. Yeah, very. But like your stand up stuff, the yeah. Netflix. Are that, very like, that, forward, like very, like, it's almost like social commentary. That I haven't seen, mom. Yeah. And storytelling. Yeah, like that, his, yeah. that special is, he's just telling a story the whole yeah. way through. It's like very, like, okay, we're here. Mm -hmm. And that's what you look at some other comics that, like, you probably look at some other, like, we we're talking about that Morgan Wallen song. Yeah. About the writing of it. Is just so like, like the guy that's putting out. I'm a, I'm a wear these holes in my jeans down the dirt road. Like, right. oh, it's it's embarrassing to him because right. Morgan's saying, "Hey, uh, whoever wrote it, Morgan and Ashley Gorley and Michael Hardy." Yeah, they uh, they go, "Hey, this is where we are. Right, it's creative creatively. This is what we're doing." Yeah, and and they're they're not like staying away from cliche country things nah, dude, especially like saying in my boots I, yeah i heard that still part of it I, I told a buddy like what a perfectly written song unbelievable you know song. yeah still talking about red wings and whiskey it, but whiskey. yeah but but it's just it's delivered in a way that's like oh i'll buy that that's great. that jason isabel song uh, oh yeah Morgan Wallen cover cover. Me up. oh my so good 
that but it's still talking about like the uh he's like I magnolias got a, and i got a pretty blonde i mean the the, the tennessee songs like, i got a pretty blonde with red lipstick that's right that's a throwback that's in that's Not, in the camp but that, yeah that's acknowledging the group Mm -hmm. And then he say we're t we're going here. What's the uh, which one's which one's has Bama Red Four Runner in it? Bama Red Four is that the unbelievable lyric? I don't even know what song that is. It was yeah. Ernest was talking about it on his yeah. pod, and he said that it was originally him and Morgan were in the car at a gas station, yeah. and it was a Range Rover. Yeah, and so they saw that, and they're like, "Well, it can't be Range Rover. That doesn't great fit. example." So tweet great example. and said yep. this still can't fits. be a Range Rover, right? It can't yeah, be. yeah. So you got that's make off it. brand. Yeah. So to be the to be the 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 the, the leader in I mean, we're all creative. You have a leader in in where is podcasting mm -hmm. going? Mm -hmm. Where is songwriting? Where is music going? Where is comedy going? And the guys that have that have been the leaders are the guys who have predicted, hey, I think this, I think we're done with this. Mm -hmm. Where is it? Like I've seen a lot of people like for my ego, it's it's great. <laughs> No, nah, how do I say like a, not in a good I way? I think that was a great way to say it. Nah, let me say not, it, when when somebody posts a, a video and somebody goes, "Hey, John Christ did this like five years ago." Yes, that that is great for you. It could be no sure. more, no great. higher compliment, yeah. right? Because you're like, yeah, we 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 like you took a shot and it hit. Yeah, we got that. We already yeah. like and we yeah. like, like creative. I think anyone creative listening to this podcast are, are like, what's where are we. Where is it going? Mm -hmm. Like, I think the people that predicted that, like, the the Tonight Show model is gone, and people are listening, to watching stuff like this because they know me and they and they have a relationship with us. They're like, if they have after right. they get done cooking dinner, they're gonna put this on. Mm -hmm. This is where the 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 future is, not a, a monologue for the whole country. Yeah, right. We do, and the, but the people that predicted that are ahead of that. Like, where is it going? Mm -hmm. And then you submit something. Every like no like well that's just, that's the new delivery system. That's I mean with look CDs and tapes. Yeah, like back in the day. Yeah, you made albums because that was the delivery system. There was no such yep. thing as singles. There wasn't. There wasn't. I mean, if yeah. if somehow it got on the radio, then yeah. the, you got to call it a single. There wasn't singles. Right. Oh, but that's like, where a single came from. The what the radio chose from the yes. Yeah. And now I mean the terms kind of homogenous at this point because it's like well what is a single like hey i'm going to release that. a single to itunes just like yeah. but is it a single oh yeah it's not a single <laughs> it's because they a have, song. it's a song yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. single really sounds single. better yeah i'm uh, dropping my new single yeah bro my my single drops uh well two weeks ago but well, hey you know. well our single's dropping <laughs> our single in, in january there you go our single's dropping that can be a single because it's it's the only thing yeah, that we'll a, probably yeah. ever <laughs> that's a do. single but somebody says like uh, like um I'm going to like D like I had a, an artist friend of mine that had a bunch of DVDs. That yeah. Would sell, I used to sell tons of DVDs at my live shows. And now you'd be like the guy, they offered him like, Hey, let's put all these DVDs on this, this new startup called Netflix. Right. And he goes, we sell too many of them at our live shows that we don't want to risk that. Right. What? What? Whoopsies! Whoops. Wow. Whoops! Yeah, because these three hundred people, we need them to buy our yeah our our DVDs, and you and instead you make, of yeah twenty seven million people having potential access, to and you it. make maybe four hundred five hundred dollars a show, and you go, this is this is the model, but but Instagram, every the TikTok, everything's yeah. changing so fast. Podcasting is changing mm -hmm. very fast. I even go. Even we've talked about, they're like, yeah, we we don't, they don't do that anymore. You're like, what? Yeah. And you're like, where is it? Like, like what? Like with, just I'm, I'm uh, with like advertisements. Mm -hmm. the, yeah, the advertising game in pods has changed a ton. It's, it's changed a ton. Yeah, over the last year. Where and then there's there's a, it's easy. It's very easy. Probably in the last five years, it's very easy to start one. But we've been able to be successful in this one because I already have a platform. So like, how do you like? Like as I take a sip of my Nespresso coffee, yeah, how do you, how do you guys market things? Oh no, we just we just uh, clip uh, <laughs> just in general. We just put. Just how just, do you market? Explain. Go. go. We just put. We just put a uh, clip. We just clip it up and put it on. Yeah. On socials. Yeah. Okay. That's the only way. And if somebody, I mean, Alex is like, he's, he's like, he, this is all he thinks about all day, every day. Yeah. But no, I mean, but simplistically, that's what it is. Is you yeah. put clips out. It's a taste test for people. They see enough taste that they like that they end up coming and getting the full meal for the podcast, the whole yeah. episode. 
It's basically it. But even that, like that whole model, we did that first in 2017, 2018. Yeah. And then that became what everybody does now. Like that is the model yeah. for podcasting. Wow. Guys, this is fun and I'm learning. There you go, yeah, man. It's a net positive. Yeah. But that, and like right. that was a... <laughs> That was over like six months. So like that's how quickly the whole industry can just change. And And that's anything. And if like we said, we said, hey, we're going to like, like start a Facebook page. He goes, in 2022, you can have a very robust page, but you can't start one. It's hard. Starting one was in 2012, 13, 14. Yeah, it's hard. You can't start one now. You just can't. Wow. Or like, but, well, and, it, and it might not be even worth starting. Might be the better way yeah, to even say that. That's like, better. You like, can't, you really can, but you can start a TikTok. Yeah, but uh, but also in, I mean, but everybody, dude, everybody listening to this pod is. I try to not to make it about me. It is mostly about me, but I don't know. Just kidding. Is like, <laughs> is that is like what like what, what whatever business you're in, whatever parent parenting is like. Th- did we used to like. In my lifetime, you would bleed and people would rub dirt in it. Yeah, yeah. In my lifetime, <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah. yeah. The, like, or like you would like, <laughs> what? That's crazy, that, dude. dude. <laughs> Maybe not in my lifetime. Not clean I, it no, up. My not lifetime, clean lifetime. It. Yeah. In my lifetime, people were like <laughs> smoking cigarettes. on front of, In front of churches. <laughs> yeah. 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 And they like <laughs> on the front steps of the first and taking the Lord's name in vain. Why it, it did. It, they would be like, when you, when you get like a bloody nose, like lean back. Yeah. So it doesn't, it yeah. doesn't like, that's horrible. That's science. Is that you do that or not? I remember being like, eight I've done being like, no, I'm not going to swallow all of this. Yeah, like, right. Don't let it like, it's like what? Like, I in feel my, like it wants to come out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I'm listening to my body. Here. Yeah. In my lifetime, not in my lifetime, I think I was talking with, we, we had an argument, it was about like a year ago with, with Shannon Ford about, about when they put wheels on suitcases. Oh. I remember growing up carrying them. In oh, yeah. In my no, lifetime. Totally. Right? We had the whole set. Carry them. You couldn't find a wheel. No. There uh-uh. was, it, it, but the wheel, like, you think how do you think how was that how did that just not there up, from the beginning like the like I remember when I was like in maybe <laughs> high school there was the the suitcase and then the the front had a latch and there was two wheels on the back you kind of pull it mm-hmm. yeah like that kind of how had that not always been around it looks like I mean, it looks like it happened about fifty years ago. Okay. Invented the first wheeled. All right. So it didn't come suitcase. into like everyone had one until like the the two thousands. But arguably one of the first amazing inventions of our species was, was. the wheel. Uh, yeah, agreed. Yeah. And it took how how Man, long, long to time. just slap one on a suitcase? It depends if you believe in evolution. Mm. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, let's jump into that. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Steve's like, you have like three. He's like, yeah, he has three like yellow cards that he can like opt out. Right. Of like a conversation. He's like, no, nah, I'm out of this. We yeah. should do that. He just holds it we up. Should I'm have too an opt in. Out I think card. I'm too in. Yeah, you're too in. <laughs> but like, how did that just? How did that just come about? Yeah. Or like they used to like, if people had like a mental illness, they would like cut them in their brain. Yeah. What was that called? Lobotomy. Lobotomy. Through yeah. your eye. It was basically an ice pick that they would go in through your eye into your brain, and they would, I think, sever the two hemispheres. That's that's just fun. That's, that's like let's that's figure it out. Time, let's they figure had it out together. They that's had to try time. it one, like yeah. the first time. They had somebody to try had it to try on somebody. It. How are you gonna know it doesn't work? Mm-hmm. So my, uh, I saw this video yesterday of a of a um, there's this girl that was like struggling to like get pregnant, and she was like, she was she was the video was she was celebrating let's say three months and the blood work from the baby came back positive. Like everything's good with the pregnancy. Nice. And I go, well, the blood work of the mom, they go, no, of the baby. Like you went, e- <laughs> what? Yeah. You went all the way in there and got blood from the bait, from the fetus. That's crazy. Ha- How long is that needle? Who started that? Yeah. Who was like, we need to get all like yeah. what? We'll just stab them. How do you know where you're stabbing? How like, do you, you I guess, guess you got to be with the, like, yeah, you, yeah. But that's I mean the baby is far enough along that you can like that's I didn't know you that could do is, that. I, but that's a, I've learned about it yesterday. I go wait. She goes the 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 caption was the blood work came back clear, and I go whose blood work? Yeah, and they said the infant. And the baby's I, like stop it. I might be wrong on this. 
Uh, I might be wrong on this. I'm Chances looking are... it up. But they, you're like, I want to know if this can happen. <coughs> they go all. They go. I go. Wait, wait. You went all the way. Yeah. Fetal blood sampling. Yeah. How does it? How does so it you happen? lie in a comfortable position on an exam table. The healthcare provider will clean your belly with antiseptic. They'll that insert adult. a long, thin needle through the belly and into the womb. Yeah. This is guided by ultrasound. Blood may be taken from several sites, such as blood vessels in the umbilical right. cord. Okay. Blood vessels in the or baby. Or blood vessel in the baby. This is usually in the liver or heart. In the heart. So they're this stabbing is, your baby in the heart with a needle. This sounds <laughs> just to get super blood. safe. This is crazy. That, it, it, but, you know, but that's like the, the advancement of like, this is normal. They just do this. Yeah. Yeah. She goes, the blood work of the baby. I go, wait, whoa, 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 wait, what? Where are you going to stab the baby? Uh, somewhere. Uh, but, but let's go for the heart. Yeah, let's, let's go for the heart. <laughs> that seems like the safest, most achievable goal. That's a, that's why you like say I don't like in terms of like whatever whatever you're positive about like like global warming like are you like positive are you, are, yeah like no no not like ninety nine percent like or is it like you gotta be like to just to have a so, like such a strong like like. Yeah, the Jesse Duplantis. Right. I go uh, like Jesse Duplantis is the Antichrist. He needs to be taken out or elevation worship, thousand dollar seats. Like they need to be to, like, are you positive? Are you positive? Right. And that's a, I'm, I'm like, well, and with the global warming thing, it's like, OK, A, are you positive? Tell yeah. me every all the wealth of Again, knowledge that you not, have. We don't know. We're saying all four of us for the record. Yeah, that's the point. We, we have don't, no idea. Right. We, we it, uh, I could be convinced either way, but that's the argument. My hunch, right? My, <laughs> I don't. Is that is that the good way to say it? Yeah, you got. Uh, I don't have solutions. I have yeah, like I, have I just wield opinions. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> like a ninja. Wild I'm not here to help. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> God no. Uh, but my hunch is yeah. that the couple that glued themselves to the railing yeah. in protest of climate. I change, think I know what you're about to say, but keep going. Let me test you on that. No, I go. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but be honest when I'm done. I will. I will. All right. I think that they could easily change to a different oh. platform of something just because that's what they want to do. Yeah. I don't think that yeah. they are as passionate about gl climate yeah. change as gluing yourself to a railing For would attention. infer. I think, yeah, yeah, I think I that it. they're yeah. just that kind of people. Like they just want to be a people. part of something? Yeah. Yeah, they just want to be. Yeah. And they were, easy, they were taken by the... The yeah. article or whatever they go, and then they saw somebody else, and they go, "We're going to go to the symphony." Yeah, and I that, think that line of thinking, I could. Yeah, that's not what I thought you were going to say. Yeah, I yeah, mean, yeah. It, it's that, and then I think they could easily pivot to like rhinoceros horns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they, they, that's next, or like yeah. I, ivory. Yeah, from, ivory tusk. Yeah, what right. did you think he was going to say? I thought he was going to say those people are absolutely convinced of global warming to do that. Yeah. They have to be absolutely. They, they better be. I think or, that they're convinced, and again. Don't know them. Don't know them. No your, solutions. Just your hunch. But still, I don't. I think that they're as convinced as the knowledge that they currently yeah, have. That, yeah, yeah, would, yeah. Would would say that, that they're convinced. allow them to do so. Yeah. Like I, if you say, "Hey, John, like, um, uh, do you think that taxes, uh, property tax in Nashville, is too high?" Yes. Okay. We're at lunch. Stand up and scream in front of all these people. <laughs> right. I go, all right. No, man, not I'm that good. much. Not that much. Yeah. No, no, I don't like it. I don't like it. But not like, like, uh, like, yeah, I don't, do I don't love it. Do you think Ticketmaster fees are too much? Yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Okay. So we're going to be on an airplane. And you sneak a box cutter in there and go to the front. Uh, not that much. <laughs> right. Not that much. Right. I mean, I don't, it's an inconvenience. I don't like it. Right. Yeah. But if, if you're going to think, if you truly... But you'd pay them to see elevation. No, I pay right, that's right. dollars easy. You'd I pay, pay all the. Fees. I'll be upfront, dude. But if you think if you think uh, global warming, if you think the world is going to combust in five years, it doesn't matter if you ruin a Van Gogh painting or ruin a symphony. If you think that, right, you should be warning everyone. Yeah. No, I mean, what? Right. A, yeah. Wow. You should be screaming from if you really believe that. You should be acting like that. Yeah. That's what I thought you were going to say. Those people are committed, but you're saying they're not. I'm saying they're committed to doing that. 
Yeah, they are committed. Yeah, for whatever but reason. But I think that yeah. their intention or their their purpose or what yeah. they're standing up against, I think there's room for that uh, just to be swapped out just for something you know, else. Yeah, for just for something just yeah. you know. Well, I think it, go. In a recap, yeah. Climate change. Yeah. An issue. Yeah. Right? <laughs> We're going to have Steve's, like, what is he, what is the summary of Steve's points like of view on Like a politician's website. Yeah. yeah. Like, what does he stand yeah. for? Yeah. What does he not? Yeah. Like, I will. Steve does not condone. I will the, provide a spreadsheet. <laughs> yeah. Once we finish. I don't know if that's right. Well, I think this, this podcast Whence. in a lot of ways is like, like the, um, like the Brittany Griner situation. Mm -hmm. getting, this is his third red card. He's going to hold up. Yeah. It's like the, the. <laughs> The um, I really want to get an opt out sign. Yeah, that's that hilarious. That's a funny idea. <laughs> just a button. You just yeah. hold it up. Just I'm opting out he of this puts topic. A, he has another a face that he puts in front of his yeah. face. It just really says good. disavow yeah. across yeah. the forehead. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new sponsor. We dun, need to dun, do dun, like dun. some kind of welcome to the new sponsors. You know, yeah. some kind of roll out the red carpet. Yeah. Uh, Miracle Brand, dude. Let me just. Miracle Brand is uh, what are they? Linens, sheets, towels. Um, I have the bed sheets is mm -hmm. what they sent me. Yeah. I, I used them last night. Unbelievable. And dude, well, let me just tell you, well, all right, well, let's get into the uh, miracle brand. Um, they sent me, what did they send you? The sheets. All right. That's what I got. The bed sheets. Yeah. Did they ask you what size what bed you had? Mm -hmm. Yeah. They asked me what size bed I had. I said a uh, King. Yep. Flex, you yep. know, right up top. Mm -hmm. Uh, unbelievable. They're like, they're, but they're like silk ash, but they're not silk. Yes. The silk is like, that ain't it. No, you don't want, you don't even want that. No, you don't want silk, but they're not like, I don't know what, the, what's a good thread count? Is, is like a, th <sighs> is like 5,000 good or is 50 good? I have no idea. I don't know. These sheets that they sent me last night, cause I go, I texted you last night. I go, Hey, are we, are we doing Miracle Brand tomorrow? Yeah. You go, yeah. I go, all right, let me put these sheets on. I was laying in the sheets when you texted you me. You are? Yeah. I got, let me put these sheets on. Mm -hmm. And, uh, the whole presentation was obviously unbelievable. Um, I think that the temperature control is their best asset, right? That's the biggest thing for me too. Yeah. My wife and I are furnaces when we go to sleep. Both You're of us. both hot. We just both get so hot. Okay. And I don't know why we can turn AC on as much as yeah. we want to. Like it's, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. These sheets though. Hit. All of a sudden, yeah. we're getting regulated in there and it's nice. Hit right. Yeah. Uh, miracle. Well, try, okay. Try miracle.com slash net positive. Uh, special deal for the holidays. Save over 40%. Be sure to use our promo code net positive at checkout to save even more and get three free towels. Yeah. So they're like, they already are good with discounts and stuff. And then they add on the net positive discount on top of that. Plus you're going yeah, yeah, to like, want to be sleeping in some John Chris sheets. Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> no, I, that was not in the ad copy. That's not in the ad copy. Yeah. Yeah. But dude, I'll, I'll say this, these, these sheets that we, that we both slept in are unbelievable. They're, yeah. they're very, they're, they're, also very they're cleaner right yeah like, and yeah. i'm somebody who wakes up stuffy a lot yeah. we record this in the morning often you can sometimes yeah. hear how stuffy i am yeah but they're self-cleaning so like these sheets are infused with natural silver that prevent 99.9 yeah. percent of bacteria bacterial growth which leaves them cleaner and fresher for three times longer than usual sheets and look and i'm a single man mm -hmm. and i don't clean my sheets ever that's right yeah obviously <laughs> <laughs> Like a real man. No, I don't clean my Once sheets. Once a year. Yeah. <laughs> clean my sheets. What My parents came in town to stay uh -huh. and I was out of town on the road. So I cleaned up so they could stay there. Nice. I did that. But I'm not, I'm, I'm saving the, I'm yeah, saving these the miracle brand sheets. These are for you. No. Yeah. Here's what I'll say. Let me just say this. And, and again, it's uh, trymiracle.com slash net positive. Use our promo code net positive to get your three free piece towel set and save over uh, 40%. But let me say this. Um, word of mouth that I, I understand why podcast average, I get it because I, I needed a mechanic for my Mustang Yeah, and my assistant just went on Google mm. and just found like a mechanic yeah. and, and it was a disaster. Yeah, it was a disaster. It was a waste of time. And that's why there's so much advertising, so much going on. Like people, uh, I go, uh, we, we met through word of mouth. Yep. You're like, Hey, this guy runs a podcast. Um, Ernest goes, I go, Hey, it's Alex. He goes, that guy knows what he's doing. Use him. Mm -hmm. That's how the whole, like, I didn't understand like podcast advertisements, but I think, I, I think I get it. Yeah. It's because people listen to this. They trust And you. they go, dude, we don't, we don't, I'll be honest. Sheets are not something that is on top of people's but people need them. Yeah. And they go, dude, you you have them. Mm -hmm. If you you know you slept in them, they're good. We trust you. Yep. We'll get them. Yep. And we're trying the products just so everybody knows. Like everything we, we try, we're we, trying yeah, these yeah. sheets. We tried other products that have been sent to us. Like and then we don't and we don't advertise for it. 
but like right. word of mouth based on trust that's all we that's that like uh, that's all we have yep is people say this is this works for us like this pair of shoes i love it mm -hmm. this hat this brand this restaurant that's all the world is yep it used to not be like that right but now there's so much uh i mean the, the guy that i needed to ask another for a mechanic in our city Hey, do you, do you, who's your mechanic mm -hmm. in essence? And I didn't, I just go, go on Google and find someone who's a nightmare. Yep. It was a nightmare. Yeah. And this is uh, uh, the sheets are incredible. They slept nice. They're apparently, I didn't, I can't obviously tell they're cleaner, but yeah. they will be over time. Mm -hmm. um, the temperature control is unbelievable. Try miracle.com slash net positive. Use our promo code net positive with a three piece. I would say, uh, I, I would say send us a photo of you in the in the sheets, but I don't think. <laughs> well, and, and I do want to clarify too. Don't do that. The URL is trymiracle.com. We're no, not saying right. trymiracle. It is trymiracle. T-R-Y-M-I-R-A-C-L-E.com slash net positive. Yeah, get yourself some sheets for the holiday, baby. Let's go. Brittany Bergreiner is back and we traded her for like a Russian, like an arms dealer. Okay, right? yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah the, this guy is like, it's like, like, the, the way that the internet kind of goes, right, is that you see something and then you go, yep, that's my side. I'm on this side. And then the, like they were, but what about the other side? Goes, right. But what about this? And you go like, if you go, hey, uh, Black Lives Matter, like rallies, this many people died at them and this many people died at January 6th. I go, what? That's a what? Like what? Wait, what? Like, what about? the this united yeah. states marine that's still in prison you're like okay what what wait what that's like another right so, hold on but that's like you don't like this you go but well, what about this and you're like yeah this. and mm -hmm. you're like ah and then you're like my only premise was like you better start putting up triple doubles <laughs> <laughs> Like we make got, it, yeah. Like, ROI, girl. Yeah, we got you back. Like we love you. Like we like, we, and like from a human rights, sit, like we, we great. great to see you. For, I don't, I don't think that that's a, a. You should be punished for that. But that goes against my premise earlier. It's that when you're in another, when me in the hat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they go. You got to play hey, by their rules. Do yeah, you hey. think that this is going to cause more people to show up to WNBA that's games? That's what I was just going to say. Not. Why? Come on, dude. <laughs> Do I have an opt out? Yeah, I need a, John needs a red card. Yeah. That, that, that's I don't believe. Like I don't believe. Uh, yeah, I don't believe it. They all the all the like women like the Bill Burr. I don't even, I don't even have to do this. It's Bill Burr's bit. Yes, yeah. women, y'all abandon your gender. Yeah, you show up. Right, y'all go to the games. If this is what y'all like, you we, should be the most. Yeah, the most excited. It should be packed, but y'all don't go. Like, don't put it on us. Right. We, not we, financed the whole thing. <laughs> Like they're subsidized by the NBA, but yes, dude, don't put it on us. We, this is y'all's thing. Yeah. Like go support it. Meanwhile, because we love the NBA, this can happen. Yes, dude. <laughs> Meanwhile, have you seen what's been going on with the Wisconsin volleyball team? I, I saw, oh, I'm not the, up the, in my yeah. Wisconsin volleyball on, news. Yeah, the nude photo, yeah. the nude video. They had nudes leaked, I think probably over a month ago now. Oh, yeah. no. Their games have, have sold out pretty much every night since that happened. And really? They, and they haven't lost since. You're not suggesting that for Brittany, are you? No, I'm just stating okay. a news article. This just okay. also Wait, happened. Really? <laughs> is this true? This is true, dude. All right. Oh, hold on. This is gonna be. This is gonna I be. I can't. I can't Google that. I can't. <laughs> <this is> gonna... <laughs> okay. It, so they. Do you want me to explain it? Yeah. You can go. Okay. Shit. Wisconsin. Uh, Lucas. Lucas earmuffs. Yeah. Uh, I'll, yeah. And I'll keep. I'll keep it. G we have for a kid. Lucas. We have it's a kid good. that uh, that he he writes in to the uh, show and he said his dad said he listens to the podcast before bed every night. Oh. He's like 10 years old. So every night at the end of the show we say good night Lucas but Lucas might have to put on the I'm uh, rethinking most of this podcast right, right now. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's cool dude. He's cool. All right, what's yeah. up Lucas? Yeah, Lucas, what's up dog? No, right, P PG is a uh, Wisconsin volleyball team, female yep. volleyball team, yep. women's volleyball team had their nudes leaked. Okay. They went everywhere. Okay. They then we'll started Steve's selling things. out games <laughs> with record attendance okay. everywhere they played. I don't know how I feel about that. And they haven't lost since that happened. That part is unbelievable. Crazy. That part is unbelievable. Because, like, renewed. which came first? Like, I don't know what their record was before. <laughs> yeah, always oh, gone. If they were, like, 0-5, oh, then they did that, and that turned the whole season around. Like, I don't know. <laughs> we're dancing on this topic, yeah. dude. <laughs> What's up, Lucas? Yeah, Lucas. Anyway. That, well, the... <laughs> 
I just uh, have but, so uh, many. Like I can't again. No, but I just think it's hilarious. I can't organize my thoughts. It was, a, but it wasn't. It wasn't. Um, again, I don't know that much about the situation, but it wasn't against their will. It was kind of amongst them, right? No, I don't think they know how the photos got out yet. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay. I don't think they know. Again. But it was where it was like in the. It was all of them, like in the locker room or something. Yes, wasn't correct. It? Right. And so, also haven't seen. Have not seen. Have not looked up. Have not for the record. So based yeah, yeah, just based so. on and the the story is not on the screen. So yeah, I, I, correct. Just, we just heard the facts. Yeah, from Alex. So, yeah. <laughs> that we weren't prepared Alex for. Facts. Right. We weren't prepared right. for for the no podcast. No pregame on this. Yeah, no pregame. So I love read the read the first sentence again. <laughs> read. I'm no, I'm just speaking. Oh no, I thought you were reading something. <laughs> no. Right? Yeah. yeah okay. Knows. So you said the. So he said it so like of course this is how it goes. You're like their nudes were leaked. Right? Yeah, like, like, like it's like 2022. We, that's just what like happened. We should know. Yeah. We didn't. Yeah, know like about that. uh, well, the games are packed. Yeah, at some point my yeah. nudes will be leaked. Yeah. Right, because I have so many yeah, of them. Sure. Like they're just yeah, they're there to be leaked. And then you won't lose for months. You yeah, just keep yeah. winning. It sounds like a recipe for success. Hey, so I think we've cracked it. So the, so let's. I'm just gonna do one joke on this topic, <laughs> and then that's it. Okay. Okay. So the first. The first like Britney Griner angle is like, what about bad? Tra like the second Britney, like the first, like my only be like Wisconsin wouldn't be rank in the top 10 of like universities that I would think would be like, like it would be like Miami, right. USC. You wouldn't think like, powerhouse out of Wisconsin. Or, that's well, I'm no, talking about the females. Oh, like <laughs> that's the only joke oh. I'm making. <laughs> <laughs> but no, again, again, yeah, again, yeah, yeah, again, yeah. again, yeah. again for <laughs> <laughs> Miami. I'm I know UCLA again. <laughs> again. Let no, me just dude. say that wouldn't be like Arizona State. Yeah, yeah right. Okay. All right, right. So this up joke makes sense. Yeah. I wouldn't have to do the rest of it. But you go. I wouldn't like. I wouldn't. I wouldn't yeah, say Wisconsin. It's one of the jokes that's that you it. can just stop saying, yeah, that's and then it. you like you get the rest. That's of it, the greatest like, joke. Wink. Yeah. Like 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 whenever. Uh, like that's the when the when comics can do that, yeah, it's always the best because you're like, what side do you take on so and so? And then they're just like, well, what about like? He's like, what? Like I'm more worried about those Britney Griner tattoos. And you're like, right. oh yeah, that's like a bet, like a different thought. Like not, not, that's not what I'm saying, but yeah, like yeah. you go like, uh, like we've talked. I talked about this before about. I used to have a joke about how. Um, pedicures are 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 pedicures are gay like dudes would be like it's gay yeah and i'm like no it's not it's like the opposite you're sitting on a throne right while like someone that is like working on your like that's a baller but you but that's the first the first premise and it's lovely it's absolutely wonderful that's incredible <laughs> or like or drinking a drink with fruit in it is gay that's like Oh, we're still doing that? Yeah. Like this strawberry daiquiri right. is unmatched, yeah. dude. Just unmatched. <laughs> What's not to love? Yeah. And That's also we're still saying gay. I'll say also that. <laughs> also, dude, give me give me That's a freaking like, umbrella in this drink and I'll crush it. Yeah. 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 I, we were on vacation. I crushed seven of those. I go, keep bringing the thing with the pineapple in it. Right. Because it's unbelievable. I only order the fruitiest drink on the menu. A, a guy that's, that's the going, one I like. You, really? On a fruit, you go, what, what, what's not to what? like, dude, I had a meeting a few months ago with this guy and we were talking, I was just like asking him for some business advice Yeah, and uh, I ordered a glass of Chardonnay. Is that a girl drink? And he told me it's a white wine. Yeah. It was a nice summer afternoon. Go for it. And he gave me flack for it. He did? And I was like, what do you do? Don't, he was like, tip one, don't do that. And I was like, bro, to who? What? I was like, uh, grow who? up. I was like, do you, do you pick your like business partners based on their beverage choices? Like, think. Like, what are like, you doing, think man? For a second, like for a split second. That's just like a, a, a like, generations passed it down yeah and then yeah. you're like this is what we do it's a hack joke it's a hack joke it's a hack joke oh man you want an umbrella in that uh, yes does a, i would yeah. love does a skirt come with that drink dude yeah. oh yeah that's, that's what, like one. or like a, you like oh a, gosh yeah you, we've on the golf course you like leave a putt short you're like you hit it with your purse or like something like <laughs> right like right what right aaron that's tuning, hilarious aaron tuning is he has a joke about aaron tuning uh, has uh saint andre golf by the way shout out on instagram unbelievable golf content he's like he did, he's like, are we still, he's like, in essence, that guy. And that's why, that's what I think comedy is great at, is like moving the culture, mm -hmm. like forward yeah. in a way, like some of the things that like, 
I mean, Bill Burr, but like even some of the things that like Trevor Wallace has like made fun of in like it, it, it to like make light of it and then you go gosh dude yeah it's nice to kind of put that to rest he does a great job too of you like trevor specifically does yeah. a great job of using things like jokes hack jokes like that yeah sarcastically against it yeah because it's so dumb like he would make that comment yeah. like oh did you hit it with your purse yeah he'd yeah. make that joke because like it's ironic because it's so bad right, yeah yeah. It. right yeah yeah or like yeah he did like a guy like i mean a guy who like very simple bit that i've shared with my brother guy who backs into parking spots <laughs> it's like yeah dude you got a toyota celica like you can't that's not you can't back that into a buffalo wild wing like <laughs> you're it's celica not, or whatever i don't even know if that still exists but like that's right. you got a dodge neon you can't back that thing in that's not it's like where's the line i don't there know there you go we ask we that talk all about time. this all the yeah. time yeah. great point where's the line where's yeah. the line yeah well that's the, the i mean can every, you can you back a honda Pickup truck? Depends. Right. I don't think so. Right. It has ground effects. Oh, Honda pickup truck? No, you can't even drive one of those. No. Yeah. <laughs> but 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 listen, that goes against what we just said. You're like, if if a guy likes a Honda Ridge line, right. yeah, and you go, oh, really? Like Ford versus Chevy guy? Like oh, you're like, oh, you got a Chevy? Like, like ho- you driving a Honda Ridge line? You are, you're less than now. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, dude. I just want to go like, I just want to go like. Like I was wearing this, I was wearing this shirt. I was wearing it yesterday. This yep. Nickelback shirt is in the grocery store, and the guy goes, the, the, "He goes, dude, that's a sick shirt, dude." He goes, "I love Nickelback, man." I go, "Yeah, because this is at war against the uh, Nickelback." Like, right? No, they don't. Yeah, they don't. They don't. They're they're good. Right? Yeah. There's there's nothing but proof that they're no, successful they're, yeah. and <laughs> wildly that's celebrated great, gosh, worldwide. Dude, yeah, dude, there's nothing but stats. Yeah. There's nothing but number. There's nothing but singles. Right. There's nothing but singles. <laughs> right. Right. Yeah. Actual singles. There's nothing but single. And if you say, oh, you eat it wherever, you must be, uh, or you must like, you must, you like, you have a purple shirt on, dude. What? Yes. What? <laughs> oh, God. So, those, yeah. th- those things that just like, like we're uh, like, there should be like a we're still doing it guy. Nice. We're still doing it guy. Like we're still doing that. But because that's what that's what you is is a bummer the most about comedy. When you go like too soon is like, whew, all right, we that's that might be where the future is, but we're not there yet. But you're still back in mm-hmm. like I had a, my comedy special that when I got canceled, it didn't come out for like two years. And then it 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 the jokes were like. They were just a little bit like when I were saying those things live, they were so like the, yeah. progressive or like, I can't believe he's saying that. And then it kind of came into like, it was just a little dated. It was still funny, but it wasn't like a, a shot. That how do you it was. think it would have like, how do you think it would have done if you put it out back then? Knowing that it was a hit. Unbelievable. I mean, it's, it was still, it's still great. Yeah. But the one we had, we, 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 uh, filmed one in July Mm -hmm. and we haven't put it out yet because it was too soon to the last one. So like, we'll probably put it out in, uh, we're going to put it out in December, but we thought that was too soon. We put it out in like March, but you're like, dude, if you keep like, it, it just doesn't like when Dave Chappelle does Saturday night live the week of, right. You're like, dude, that's the, like, yeah social commentary if i had like a britney griner joke on my it's like that's gone right that's gone next week yeah right unless she starts playing again and putting up triple doubles right anything else in the news um the bts yeah. thing yeah we got an update on uh one of our bts guys. all right hold on steve oh. do you know bts i mean i know who they are okay they all have to stop touring because they got to go to the military that's right yeah you knew that i heard this story yeah yes. they had to go to the military so my joke was like what if you're like on a like a, a, a North Korean like a, a, a South Korean mm-hmm. South Korea. What if you're like on patrol and you're like you're like wait Jimin like that's the guy <laughs> yeah. that's like the lead singer. You're like hold on what? So we have an update apparently. It worked great for Elvis. Yeah, did he do it? Yeah, he he, he Elvis was served right. Yeah, great great point of view. Elvis went to the military. So this is Jin. He's Jin. he's the oldest member of the band. Jin. Okay. He just uh, got his his military buzz cut. Okay, which is drastically different from. Uh, the long like flowing before? locks he had before. Oh, yeah. yeah, I'll show you. Jin right from BTS. This was him. Okay, all right, Jin. Well, that's him before. Uh, before and after. I, before I will say. Him. I will say. Uh, right here. Yeah, that's a good looking guy. Um, yep. checking in with that swoop is gonna be a problem. 
with that frat with that TikTok swoop he has. Yeah. Like you go in for the, your first day. I would rather go. Let me cut my hair. Oh yeah. Before yeah. I go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. How yes. many times well, do you think he, hey, he tries hey. to be like, but BTS dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, if he's is he there? He's just got yeah. This is his his quote was I look cuter than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now I will weigh in on that. <sighs> oh, this is where you're gonna pipe in, dude. I'm, I'm, opting, out. I'm yeah, opting out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, no man, you, yeah, you, you you go. All right, I'm gonna uh, with that haircut with that pro. He knows that he probably can't pack hair gel. Yeah, and also. If you're going in the uh, in the in the 13th Infantry Division, and you're gonna go, well, let me just. Uh, do you think, Steve? Do you think he wants to be on BTS or wants to not be BTS in there? Does he want other guys to be like, "What's up, dude"? You like him just being one of the guys, no, or does he want to not think be him? It's a thousand percent BTS. I would want to be. Yeah, yeah. He's like, I'm. I'm not. I'm not one of you. I'm different. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> we are a, not the same. I was in that when I was in rehab, that same thing where everybody's in there and everybody's anonymous, but every like one of the like either like uh uh food prep people or somebody they're like, hey dude, like I know who you are. And I was like, ah yeah, yeah, again right. for my ego, I not know good. You do. Again for my ego, not good, not good. Where I'll say that. But yeah, it was like you, you he's like, Hey, everybody's gotta be everybody's gotta have their uh um uh mattress tucked in with the thing in the corners yeah. lined up and he goes, Yeah, but I'm Jin, <laughs> he's like, ah. yeah, you want you want the preferential yeah. treatment. Yeah, he's like, yeah. you guys have. Do you know what I'm gonna do the day we we're done with this? Yeah, <laughs> the day we get out of here. Yeah, my life looks yeah. dramatically different. I than got yours. a private jet. Yeah, waiting. Yeah, when I get out of here, he pulled up with like three black oh. out SUVs. So you don't like, think that's he's it? wanting the yeah? The, yeah the no, 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 no. He came he's, in with a, like with the cavalry, yeah. like the whole okay, that. Yeah, it's a flex. He's, yeah. He's, Definitely. Motorcade. He goes, hey, here, here, where's the base? He's looking at people going, your mom dropped you off. Is that it? This is him walking in with all these other people. No. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's him. Why don't we start with this story? This is unbelievable. This that is full great. Length, that full length jacket. Fila. That's a flag. Swag. That's kind of swag. What's the bag? What brand's the bag? I don't know, guys. I'm not feeling the Fila. But just I'm also guys. old. Also, they're still wearing masks. Is this recent? Yeah, this is this week. They still wear masks over there. And wow. they should. Yeah, they're on top of each other. Every, but no, those cities are like... They just had an outbreak, I think. Yeah, yeah. I don't know like about Korea. I think China, China did. I don't yeah, know. yeah, yeah. I mean, that Franklin doesn't... I don't think they... They're like, was there a, was there a yeah. virus? I went, I went to a, a um, the Loveless Cafe down there, and they, they said, they go, do you have a Vax card? And I... And, I, and if, they, if you show it, uh, they don't let you in. Weird. That's a joke. Okay. Okay. Oh. That's my joke. Everybody. Okay, thanks, guys. Wow. <laughs> Dang it, dude. That is serious. Dang it. Dude. I was going to be like, what, oh, dude? Wow. Oh. <laughs> it's not that was good. one of those things that it's I was talking about. It's not as good as your Remember, transgender joke. No, yeah, you should have assumed a vaccinated. Uh, really, guys? You guys all looked <laughs> at me like I was crowd. insane. I go, I just, did I deliver that wrong? I thought you were being serious. I thought you were being serious. <laughs> yeah. I just said, are you, if you if you show a Vax card, they don't let you in. Yeah. Meaning, because you said in Franklin, they don't do right. it down there. And no. I was like taking that one step further. No, we yeah. get it. We just thought you were serious because yeah. it's believable. I didn't, I didn't uh, like That's misunderstand your words. <laughs> I, knew, I knew what you were trying to, the knowledge you were trying to impart. You're like, no, did you get it? You're like, no, we got no, it. We, we got, got it. it. We didn't know it was a thing to get. I just, I was coming, yeah, I was coming too serious. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I have to set that. Up. That's the perfect example of you get back in the in the green room. We go. Why did that one not work? It's too believable. Yeah, it's I too thought Loveless Cafe yeah. would do that. So he goes, uh, <laughs> "Would you take if you go? He has a syringe. The the hostess has a syringe. Then you'd be like, all right, this is obviously not real. Yes. Right. See, the the line was too. Yeah. yeah see, <laughs> yeah. we learned something. We did. And then that positive. I yeah. think if you're the gym, how long is he going to be in the military? I believe it's three years. Oh, tough. Yeah. Mm. All right. Let's get to some, let's get to the, an email or two. We always have a. Uh, this is the way that we end the podcast with getting to the emails. Oh, yeah, right. we have, uh, we have a few. Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, let's get to the cancer one first. Okay, cool. Yeah. You want to read it? Uh, I'll read it. Okay. Uh, big fans of the podcast. All right, so last week or two weeks ago, Steve, we talked about uh, things aren't what they seem. And I talked about uh, um, uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month for the NFL. And everybody's like, yeah, we love it. And, and my friend that has breast cancer said, this is the worst month for me because it, uh, it reminds me of all the whatever. Like and all I, the trauma that she like everybody's like breast cancer awareness we support it i go well think about the other side just like in the uh just like in the hat in church just like the uh 
the uh, televangelist, just like the Britney. Just think about the other side. Uh, so I just finished last week's podcast. I'm just going to give an amen to your friend's wife with the breast cancer survivor and hates the month of October. I'm a breast cancer survivor too. 13 years in remission, diagnosed at 30. The whole month gives me a knot in my stomach. It's weird because on one hand, I feel the support and love from those family and friends who mean well, but they're just so much corporate greed profiting from our disease. I promise you there's not been one pink cent that has gone to me or anyone I know diagnosed with breast cancer. Hmm. That's fair. And the way it's blown up for marketing for corporations, just bombarded by it everywhere, reminding me of my seven surgeries, my year spent in the chemo chair, Having to tell our three kids that mom has cancer, it absolutely sends a shock down my spine and honestly makes me want to throw up. So I completely identify with your friend's wife with PTSD. I have it from my diagnosis too, and October sends me into overdrive. I'm glad to hear I'm not alone feeling this way. So on the net, it's a positive. Mm. Y'all have a great day. Love the pot. That's amazing. Wow. Bro, I, I read like a lot of emails from that kind of stuff. And that is like... Uh, like maybe like breast cancer awareness like maybe but also like th it's there's another side of right. th of this mm -hmm. Every, and then i said and i said that because i was a little bit i don't even know i wasn't planning on saying that about the breast cancer awareness but it just kind of like come up off the i'd go i think and you go oh mm -hmm. wow like there's a lot of like there, every, there's a lot of like critiques of like dave ramsey these days like it's like trendy, very trendy on TikTok to be like anti Dave Ramsey. Mm -hmm. You're like, dude, what's the anti Dave platform? Like, the, like the like we want to live our life, or like he's asking you to sacrifice too much. I'm like, dude, there is Dave Ramsey. In terms of people taking back their finances and yeah. taking control of their lives, like that Preston. No one's done it better ever. Nobody. Right. Okay. And Did also, nobody. So don't do shut, it. Shut. Just shut. Oh, I'm going to get just too don't, Okay, right. Just don't, just, whoa, 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 whoa. John, John, John. No, John. I get, dude, I get too worked up. I get too worked up usually in defense. He just rips through and the I, shirt. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. I'm like in defense of Preston Wood Baptist Church who has put on a Christmas play that like the one year they had like drummers and the next year goes, let's put a drummer in a costume. And the next year, let's put a drummers instead of like having the drum, let's put them w where they walk around and drum. Let's walk around in, let's walk down the aisles and drum. Let's walk down the, let's lift like where, what are you saying? That was it, Preston Wood? Yeah. Okay. No, I, no, I didn't know that that was the actual church. Preston Wood. Yeah. yeah. Preston Wood. You're like, what, what, what are you, if a, uh, uh, elevation church is, is uh stealing my like what are you saying you you can't just be irresponsibly getting on tiktok and be like this like wh what you, like th think yeah just please think like i'm supporting but like, there's another side of that and that's what the net is it was she is saying is like i don't think anything or like this guy is a is a televangelist all he does is take people's money or like I was with a guy that said he right. saved his wife's life. Mm -hmm. I love a good John Chris rant. It's, Dude, what, it's it one of my it, loves, great loves I, I, of life. So def I find myself in, like, in def and like I would say, Dave Ramsey, I know, I, I don't, if people say they know me, I'm like, dude, I met you at the golf course twice. I don't know <laughs> right. you. I was about to say, I know Dave Ramsey because I've seen him at the golf course twice. And yeah. I said hi to him like for a second. He would be like, I don't know. You I don't know you, dude. He can't speak Who on my you? behalf. But I'm speaking on his behalf by right. saying, dude, you think he's a little bit cocky in his advice or you think he's, I'm like, dude, it, it, like if, what have you, the TikTok person that's like, what have you given? What have you? So wait, so Dave Ramsey is too cocky and you love LeBron James. You say, <laughs> like, what are you saying? <laughs> what words are you saying? What words are you saying? Also, God. I'll stand in defense of the concept of why do you have to be anti? Just don't do it. Just don't, just be. Just do something else. Just talk about. the. Why do you have to go like have a platform against it if you don't think that his way of doing finances yeah. isn't the the your jam then, then just don't shut do it up dude that guy say that guy you have a job if you live in nashville you probably have a job because of dave <laughs> nah, really, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's might be a little too much i love it but i always find Wait, myself was that a joke no nah, that was really yeah. <laughs> okay. i always f find myself in in opposition of the mainstream thought mm -hmm. like this shirt mm -hmm. it's like sure everybody uh, i was like breast cancer awareness uh, i go well uh, everybody's crushing 
uh, Prestonwood Baptist Church. Uh, everybody's it's like easy. Mm -hmm. It's very easy to be like Elevation Church, a thousand dollar tickets. They need to okay, fun, fun, fun premise, mm -hmm. yeah. fun premise. I just have no fun premise. I have no problem with that. That's why you work at Staples, dude. And you're on. <laughs> uh, anyway, to see. Oh. then I get mad and I do that. All right, move on. Next email. Thank yeah. you for the email, Erica. Yeah, sorry. That's amazing, Erica. Lovely. Yeah, thank you for writing in. That was thank beautiful. you for sharing. Yeah. All right, next one. Oh no! What does this say? Oh, okay. All right. We said. Uh, I, I the joke was Steve. I got to preface this. I okay. said I was at Chick Fil A and waiting for my food, and they uh, and the, there was nobody out there. And they go, is uh, they go Deshaun? It wasn't Deshaun, but I don't remember what they go. Deshaun. I go, no, I'm not Deshaun. <laughs> like, and we got kind of we got kind of like uh, people called us out for it. They're like, dude, you can't say that. The, anyway, this girl's in support of that. Hey, huge fan. Saw you in Virginia Beach. Coming next time. Uh, I was nauseous because I was pregnant. I thought, all right. That said, I have a bone to pick because my name is Courtney Hansen and my parents immigrated from Korea. I wonder if she knows Jimin. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> this was supposed to be a redemption bit, John? Yeah, sorry. Sorry. Uh, You're just, no, give me the shovel. Yeah, Stop yeah, it. Yeah, Stop yeah, digging. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> Uh, my parents immigrated from Korea, but I do not speak Korean. I speak Spanish. I am Spanish interpreter by trade. So yes, I get confused by the looks. I do not look no, like. I get some confused looks. Oh yeah, I, yes, you're. Right. I do not look like a Courtney, and I get pissed when people overlook me waiting room because based on my name. Great point. We will uh, in 2022. There's been so many mixed race people that look so many mixed race couples where I get my last name and adopted people. In the South and other parts of the U.S., there isn't quite as much of it in D.C., but East Coast, it's super common and people speak lots of different languages. That said, I get your point about the names, but depending on where you live in the U.S. or world, you can't assume anymore. Love the podcast. Listen every week. The Corey Asbury episode is fire. Courtney Hansen, not Han, Kim, Lee, or Lee. Thanks. <laughs> Man, Hilarious. thanks, Courtney. Yeah, Hilarious. I mean, I feel her. Hansen's the whitest last name. Courtney Han Oh, she uh, capitalized Hansen. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's that's... Okay. Okay. For for, for for hey, listen. For everybody, that was the band, right? There's two Hansen. little girls oh, and a monkey. Nah, wow, <laughs> like, dude. What? No, that's he said two little girls and a monkey. That's a, it's a good joke. Okay. Hey, for anyone, for anyone trying to uh, change people's uh, I, minds or perceptions, do it like Courtney. Yep. Courtney opens up, says, oh, for, first of all, Courtney does this privately. Mm -hmm. Uh, not publicly on Twitter. Good. I can't believe Good John point. Christ. Save it. Yep. Save it. Right. Save it. Go back to Staples. Uh, I should just, that should be an ongoing thing. Go back to Staples. Staples. Uh, no no disrespect to anyone that works at Staples, by the way. How do you know if Staples exists anymore? Yeah, <laughs> that's, be that's even better. <laughs> yeah. Starts out, huge fan, love you. Meaning, I'm on your side. I'm meeting you with love. Up front. I, I come in yes. peace. Yes. I come yes. in peace. Yes. Yeah, that's like in, in Braveheart where they yeah. walk out with like, hey. Yeah. And here's the here's the, here are the facts. You or or I'm gonna give you a benefit of the doubt because you were just speaking off the dome. Mm -hmm. This is why you shouldn't do that anymore. I love you, sincerely. And then yeah, and, and then, concise. Like we don't need to know about her mom. Got it. We just got it. Got it. Just got it. give me what we need to know. And then wraps it up with what? A hilarious a joke. joke. Yeah. yeah. Courtney Hansen, not Han, not Kim, not Lee. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Laugh emoji. That's it. Yep. Well That's done. That's it. Thanks, Court. That's a great email. Yep. If you are trying to change anyone's mind on the internet or in your family or your wife or your husband or your kids, do it like that. Yep. And I and I will I will ag agree. I'm not gonna. Uh, it was out of pocket for me to say that, uh, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna apologize for things. I say things all week, every week. Right. If we're gonna go down this road, I'm not gonna. But I I I I'm I'm on her side. Also, if we're not allowed to make. If we're not allowed to play with stereotypes, then like yeah, well, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I don't think she's saying she's mad. She's just saying no. I, she yeah. and she's right. Absolutely, she's yeah, on an individual right. basis for sure. You can't assume I never somebody's a, race by their name. Yes, I never met right. a Korean Courtney. And yeah, and to her and her defense is like she's not saying this is the worst nope. problem. I'm. This is a life altering nope. issue. I right. am distraught right. by John. You I'm are, are you? Yeah. Are you disappointed? Young? Really? Oh, yeah, disappointed. Yeah. 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 Save it. <laughs> and, Save it. And especially if Courtney that, Hansen. if, if that, if that was more aggressive yeah. coming after the breast cancer email, yeah. it would just be by eh, we, well, we eh. don't read them. We don't read them. No, we get, we get lots of them. Mm -hmm. We get lots of, Oh, I can't believe what was the one that, uh, 
something about i don't remember it's something about who knows i don't read them yeah. but that's that's two, two top shelf emails because we're on the because on the net what are we doing here we're finding positive we're finding positive that's Dude, right that last one we right, got one we more go. this is a callback uh, too this is when we were talking about uh profile pictures okay oh i said uh like if you were miss america steve in 2000 how long do you put that on your can you can you put miss america 2004 on your oh, profile that's, now that's a that's a great question yeah and so she says we we're listening to the podcast while road tripping for our honeymoon okay amazing all right road tripping for the honeymoon okay we, how do we feel about that great do what you gotta do i'm just glad you made the honeymoon john okay yeah road trip for the honeymoon i have a question related <laughs> to the topic mentioned in the moms versus mermaids episode okay yeah how long is it okay for your mother-in-law to have your wedding photo as her profile <laughs> 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 Hold zero <on>. days <laughs> it is just <laughs> zero not even a day it is uh, just a picture of her son and i taken by the photographer on our wedding day because that's what we were talking about was how long can you keep your wedding photo as your profile you, how long can you keep your wedding photo i'd say I'll, we give you a year yeah we said a year we said a year same now, with, same with how long you can give somebody a gift for their wedding. So it kind of uh, now I don't fits. know I don't know you, yeah you can't I don't think there's you, the, there's just you got to dig deeper into the motivation behind it like I I need to I need to talk to this mom like what's the value uh, there? Jenna Jenna well okay Jenna the, Jenna is the in law right so right you, right she's if if this was Jenna's mom she yeah. would she goes hey, what are they doing over there in the in that in my husband's family. Is what she's, she's like. Well, we wouldn't do this. You think if right. Jenna, if Jenna's mom was the one who had it, she'd be okay with it? Yeah. But since it's in law, she's like, eh. you know, I need to see. I need to see the crop. I don't believe. I, I, don't I need see, to see yeah, how it's cropped. Crop. Is I she just, fully in it, or is it is just the, the mom? Son? It cut out. Right. Is the mom? It's it's. Wait, hold on. No, it's I, just a picture of her just, son and I. It's just them two taken like on a beach. It's just Jenna <laughs> and Hubs. <laughs> All right. That's incredible. That's dude. a catfish if here's I ever what, heard it. Here's what I believe about Jenna. <laughs> this is what I believe in my heart about Jenna. Let's that if it. it was her mom that did it, yeah. she would just say, mom, take it down. Mm. But she doesn't feel like she can say that to in-law mom. This is why we have guests. And it's early in the relationship. To, uh, not yeah. early in the relationship. I mean, they just point. newly she married, She can start though. bossing the in-law mom around. Right. She goes, hey, is this not like, who would help me with this? I want to know what the husband The thinks. podcast. Yeah, yeah. but <laughs> Jenna... I think it's time for you to tell your husband yeah. to tell his mom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you got to tell just husband to tell mom. Put a picture of herself or her cats yeah, or, or whatever. Or, or, or hey, you took a photo with them at the wedding. Surely, right? Get, but get because this that. is me and my son. I think one time totally. I was talking to. This is embarrassing, not really, but I was like <laughs> chatting with a someone that had like a, a, a like a private, a private like pro. Her Instagram was private, and it was a it was like a mom, and like a daughter. Okay. was in the profile photo but the girl's name was like i'm getting them i'm, I'm getting the uh, uh, uh specifics of this mixed up but it was like madison and i go okay i think madison is the kid like i think i'm talking to the kid right not the kid but like i think i'm talking to the like the daughter the child yeah but it was like they came to like a the, the show or the meet and greet and it was like the mom <laughs> I go, I mean, it wasn't an in-depth conversation. We're like, oh, I thought, I assumed because you're just kind of piecing these things together. So if, if somebody goes, hey, somebody from the PTA or whatever goes, I found the mom's profile. Is this like a, is this her? The profile picture should, is you or nothing? It's not another person. Yeah. Right. No, it can be a, your car. Right. It can be your business. It can be a kid, I guess. What? It can what do you be mean? Anything what do you mean? Else. How can it be a kid? It, it can be a kid. One. A it? mom could have their three kids as her profile pick until they're how old? Yeah. Oh man! But that's Great assumed. Point. But that's Alex. assumed by anyone that finds them. They go, "Oh, that's not her." Uh -huh. That is confusing because everybody has a wedding photo, right? So is this? If she puts it in black and white or one of those antique filters, that it might be her, <laughs> right? That's tricky. That's yeah, yeah. I think if it's I like your, it, I like on the way on the way to the honeymoon. Like oh, this yeah. is our first first order of business <laughs> as a married couple. I feel honored to be involved in this. This is amazing. I feel honored to be involved in this. So I'm how say never? Yeah. How long? The answer is zero days. You can post photos of it. Not your profile. No, it's it's, not, it's no. not like I mean your profile is like if there's one thing I want you to know about me, this is this is the picture. Yeah. This is the this is the entryway. Yeah. 
This let's let's well let's paint weird. a scenario. Let's paint a scenario that that that's allowed. Okay. First of all, only son is this is her only son. Mm-hmm. Uh, he was lost at sea. Or <laughs> <laughs> he he was. Oh, oh, oh. So the only <laughs> justification to do it is that the guy's dead. He's dead. No, he was. That's where I was going to go. They found him. They found him. I was going to go the death route. I was going to go if I die, and that's the only good photo you have of me. Yeah, you. I watched the story. That's still a good post. (laughs) Not a profile. No. Okay. Yeah. It's still a good post. I watched the. uh, uh, I watched uh, the. the news that Lydia does the news every night. They always see stories, and they're just sometimes there's wild stories, and there's just this. Two guys from Nashville, they were like, um, they were like, they were going hunting in Alaska. And the guy goes, um, the story is the guy goes, I'm, um, I'm, I got to go down to the river, down around, I got to walk a mile to deliver food or, or do something. And he's never seen again. Whoa. He's gone. And I, I typed into like the other anchors. We have like a group. I go, that guy's dead. That guy's dead for sure. That guy's dead. Like he got, and he was wearing camo and you're in Alaska and th- there's no way, there's no way yeah. to find, I go, right. that guy, he, he can't walk, the, he could walk, if it's, you could yell. I go, that guy, and I go, I, and then they go, and then she said, well, there's like, he like, <laughs> he said, well, it, there's like some speculation that he like ran off with another woman. I go, that's a heck of a... <laughs> You can put that on your profile pic. <laughs> that, you can put that on the profile pic. You can put that on the profile. I'll allow it. All right. So this guy's in, this guy's in essence gone. Is mm-hmm. what I'm saying. Is back to the profile. Right, this right, guy's right. gone. Right. And he's been gone for a year. And if he, uh, he has to turn up, but there also has to be something about how he was never allowed to be married for some reason. So this has to be. He has to be never allowed to be married, and then he got married, and they put that on the cover of. Time magazine. John, this is very complex. This no, is a, that's not, this I'm a trying big to, exception. I'm trying to yeah, justify he thought it. this through. I'm trying to justify yeah, it yeah. for him. He a has lot to of be, stars got to line up for yeah, this. Lot, well, <laughs> otherwise, I don't I think she's out. Yeah. I think there's no way she can do it. Yeah. Of her son photographed on our wedding day. It's the day after. Maybe she's one of those people that has a new profile photo. Like I follow people on Twitter. They're like every basketball game, their their profile is. My brother in law's profile is of uh, Stetson Bennett. Who won for? He's a big UGA fan. He just that's allowed, right? Because he go well. That's obviously a professional football player. Mm-hmm. So like, if I'm if your profile is Steph Curry, I go well. You're not Steph Curry, right? I'm assuming that you're right. a fan of Steph Curry. Yeah. Okay, so like flip it, flip it. To I the know, mom for dude. A second. Like, I what know, if she's just dude. Like, this is like a, so just she's just so proud. Like she just is so happy, and she puts her kids and she puts her pets. I'll take the other side. She can yeah. she can have this as long as she wants. Because, as long as she wants now? Because, yeah, because it's a lost cause. It's a lost cause. What's you gonna teach her the the etiquette of profile pictures? She's probably yeah. a sixty year old woman who yeah. does, you know she's just that proud and excited and yeah, be flattered hey, by it. Jenna, if you're on. watching or listening, let's talk about the traffic that uh, your mother in law is getting to her site. It's probably yeah. not that big a deal. Yeah. Oh, on her face. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. Eleven views a week. So oh, now we're all taking Jenna's no, 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 mom's I, side. I, I'm gonna take her side. Mom. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. I was about to clarify. I still sh- think it shouldn't happen. But we don't want. Li- hey, <laughs> listen. How? Where is it? Where is it rank? Is it? Is it wearing a hat in church? Is it? Yeah. Where is the- it rank? Is it? Yeah. Is it for Christ's sake? Yeah. Where is it? Well, think about this. This is the first day of marriage. Looks like first yep. day. Yep. We we don't want to be responsible for putting Jenna and her mother in law at odds. No. First day off to, for out of the gate. Absolutely. We not. want to put them on the same page. Agreed. So we're saying Jenna let let your mom do, let the mother in law do it. Mm-hmm. She's just going to have her she and she should honestly be uh like people are posting photos of her wedding. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's what you want. I'm gonna, I'm just going to give Jenna some life advice real just, Oh no, um, here know. we go. No, Speak to her. This Speak is, to her. Yeah. Hey Jenna, I promise you there's going to be bigger issues coming your way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah, yeah, there you go. In your marriage career. Dude, that's perfect. It yeah. may, it may be it wise to choose yeah. a different hill to die This is on. not the one. <laughs> this ain't yeah, it. Yeah. There's, uh, how big, how much, I promise you. Yeah. Like, how much bigger of hills? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it could get pretty big. Yeah. Yeah. That's this like is, a, this that's is great, like. That's a great rap. This right? is perfect. Smoky Mountains. Yeah. That's perfect right there. Uh, <laughs> so you got you're going Everest coming your way. Yeah, yeah. Everest is coming. Yeah, we're going. Yeah. We're going Rockies uh, next. Yeah, Rockies next. Alps yeah. maybe. 
then cascades then, yeah somewhere rockies there. yeah then you're gonna be you're gonna be in, and then we're going you're to gonna the be in the, nepal yeah. sooner or later you're yeah. gonna be in nepal. that's that's where you can email john back and, and then we'll still help, help by that. the way <laughs> yeah we'll still help uh tour dates uh we're going all over the country you got anything to promote steve our besides our single Oh, it's dropping. Our single Man, is going to be. Single. We don't have a name for it yet, but it'll be coming out. Uh, I'm on tour 40 dates, and the the live we show. We have a name for it. Uh, the emotional support tour. Oh, the song. Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. so you're saying you have a uh, name for the tour? Yeah, I have a name for the tour. Yeah. What's the name of the song? We don't have a name for it. Isn't I thought it? it's every Christian music video. Yeah. This is every Christian. It's just music the most video. clunky, stupid name it's ever. Unbelievable. That goes along with the ridiculous. I'm not going to play. Should I play it for a second? Play like. I don't know. Hold hold on. On. Look, taste. it's your podcast. Give him a taste. You want. Hold on. Let me give him a taste, dude. This hold on. This, this is gonna be worth it for everybody. It's getting mastered this week, dude. Get pumped. Oh, this song is wild. Dude. Let me see if I can <laughs> find it. I gotta scroll back in the thing. Oh, it goes that, and then it goes that. Here, my, oh, here it is. Oh my, can I play it like this? Yeah, this well, is my and, song. And we're, we're, the, the intention was to make it sound like a Christian song. Nice. I'm in already. <laughs> the stomp. Listen to this, bro. <laughs> First one is always shot in black and white. <laughs> It's a bop, dog. Very That's good. coming out so hard. Yeah, I can't wait. Mildly wait. attractive yeah. actress. We're gonna put. Oh, we gotta do that at Whiskey Jam. We're gonna do that song at Whiskey Jam. <laughs> yeah, dude. We have to. We have to. Text Ward. Is that the? Is that the forum for it? Um, probably not. Yeah, probably not. We're I think it'll it be out. lost. On like it's. No, it's gonna be. It's gonna live in infamy, dude. It's gonna yeah. be unbelievable. Yeah. Uh, we had some other people. We had some other people on on the track that cannot be named. Correct. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. they don't it's they don't want to be involved. Oh. <laughs> Cause I can't sing, but I'm the singer in the band. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. And and you're also like the producer guy who like beats yeah. in and says like yeah, it doesn't I'm also even the producer. Yeah. Uh Steve Feed, ladies and gentlemen, you can follow him on uh socials. He, he make music. He makes yeah. music, singer, songwriter. Writing right guy songs. that does good things. Yeah. Uh, man. uh and a good and and I should say uh uh when I was in rehab, uh, uh, uh well still currently, but a, a very good friend to me. And he spoke a lot of truth in into my life that it, it, in a lot of ways saved my life. Amazing. I should dude. say that. I should say awesome. that. I should say that at the beginning. But yeah. Uh, or one hour and 52 minutes in. You're like, yeah, you could have said that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> could no, have I mean, that. For, the, uh, for those of you who are still yeah. you know, with Stand, us. No, they're here. Dude. Yeah. They come in strong. They're here. Uh, Lucas, good night. Sorry about the Wisconsin volleyball thing. <laughs> Sorry, bud. Uh, yeah. um, we're gonna, he's going to come to the Indianapolis show. We'll take a photo with him. Nice, I'll, I'll apologize to him. Though. Thank you. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you next week. I mean, yeah, sure. It was a little weird, but on the net, net on the, on the, it, it, it was a positive. It was a positive. <laughs> you cannot be serious. But on the net, it's a positive.